on. Come on. I'm talking to you. Good morning and welcome to the Opie and Anthony Show, the ONA virus spreading across America. Are we going to make believe that uh, we're actually live on the radio today? or Let's attempt okay. to actually make believe. Yeah, yeah. Pretend They're not that, gonna believe uh, this that. is the morning and we're here and we're just like, uh, what, what time is it? It's, uh, well, look at the clock. It's, it's uh, uh, whatever yeah, that is. It's, it's uh... a little blurry, <laughs> but uh, it's the morning. It's the morning. Oh, screw that. Let me have some orange juice. <laughs> yeah. Hold on, let me take a sip of my orange juice. <laughs> Nice dark mm. orange juice with a head on it. That's a good dark orange juice made by the fine people at Guinness, I believe. <laughs> Man, I uh, uh, never mind. Good breakfast <laughs> drink. I uh, I left something that looks very <laughs> similar to that. Yeah. In the old, you know what? Before we started broadcasting, yeah. you healthy. figure that out at home. That's healthy when it's that dark too. That means it's loaded with blood. Congratulations. <laughs> <laughs> Three days left. To yeah. <laughs> All right. Here's the deal. We are backstage at the Hard Rock Cafe getting ready for our Halloween party, the yeah, ONA Halloween party. The big Halloween extravaganza. Yeah, people are being uh, let into the Hard Rock as we just kind of hang out back here and get our thoughts together. So we thought we'd do the first break here, set yeah. up the whole thing, and then we'll broadcast on that stage in front of all those animals. Anything that's different from the experiment that was last year uh, for the Halloween show. Remember that? Mm -hmm. All we did was the curtains opened. Uh, we were on the stage trying to broadcast and it was pandemonium. There was no way to do a radio show Did that way. Fez tried to help us in this. Oh, they tried, and uh, Fez had a heart attack. That's yeah. that's how bad it was last year. Yeah, he blames... A member of the team had a heart attack. He blames last year's Halloween yeah. party on his uh, on his heart attack yeah. that he ended up having. It was, The pressure of having to do that uh, was too much. Yeah. So we figured logistically we would do it a little different this year, come into the dressing room, not be out with the animals... Uh, for the first break, and then slowly work our way in to the creatures and beasts an that are our fans. An hour from now, we should just wave and then come back <laughs> just, in for an hour. <laughs> just kind of open the curtain a little and yeah. wave Be out. really arrogant about we'll it. coming up. <laughs> Opie and Anthony and Jimmy, we'll see you in a couple of minutes. Please stay out there, people. <laughs> And just do nothing but stay back here. We should turn the music off and make them just stand there in the quiet. <laughs> <laughs> They're broadcasting. Torture those tools. I'll stand there in their hot, stupid outfits. <laughs> hey, the costumes are great. Yeah, they saw a few costumes great. out there. I tried to just uh, leave the car and bolt inside. Uh, saw a few costumes. Wait, though. did you say car? Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, here we go. It's already started. Oh wow. How long in before <laughs> Opie has to throw a plug out? <laughs> oh, my God. It's two minutes. I got a list of plugs. You said car, so I yeah. have to say thanks for the lift from the great guys at the Classic Car Club of Manhattan, where oh, yeah. for less than what it costs to park a car in the city, you can become a member and drive any of their fantastic cars from Rolls Royce to Ferrari, vintage muscle cars to new super exotics. You can drive them all. Call 212-229-2402 or visit www.classiccarclub.com for more info. Coming soon to L.A. and Miami in 2007. I heard you rolled up in a, a Rolls Royce. Yeah, yeah, convertible. Yeah. And an old uh, Impala. Yeah? Yeah. I believe it was an Impala. Right there, Keith? Uh, yeah, 67 Super Sport. 67 Super Sport. Big, huge engine with headers on it. Mm -hmm. It couldn't even talk. It sounded like, you, you ever talking to a fan? Uh, not a fan. Yeah. A fan. <laughs> talking to a fan. <laughs> All right, Jim, go. <laughs> There's a few fans you've talked into. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I got a hair in my mouth. Yeah. I think it sounded something like this. <laughs> or more, or more like, this couldn't be mine. Boot in the gut. <laughs> yeah, so we rolled up in some fancy cars yeah. outside the Hard Rock. Fancy was... schmancy. Saw the, uh, the line with a few of the um, mm -hmm. uh, people that I'm sure will be contestants in the big uh, costume party. A couple of people as pal talk screens. Oh, really? Yeah. All I saw was a giant set of cans um, in a pal talk uh, square. Nice. So uh, people doing show-related stuff. Apparently, there's a girl that is dressed like me from my rot gut days <laughs> with a big afro and a goatee. Oh, I hope great. I hope she had to put it on with some uh, glue, yeah. and it's not just her natural facial hair. <laughs> I saw someone... Sink. Dressed as me, said board op on the back of his uh, brown oh, t-shirt, and then the destroyer in the front. He's wearing sunglasses and he's got my hair and everything. Nice. I saw a uh, proctologist ah. with a uh, with a glove. Oh, good. And uh, let's just keep it friendly here. Uh, two of the fingers were a different color on the glove. Oh, interesting. Red. 
or a uh, green something. I'll, it, I'll see them. I'll see them let's later. Let's just keep it at that. So maybe the, they yeah, weren't the primary radio. colors. No, 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 they weren't. <laughs> I, I believe they're a fan of earth tones. <laughs> a mixture. Speaking of which, you went and uh, you know got your checkup, and then the doctor yeah. called today. The doctor calls uh, as I'm trying to take my little nap. So uh, we can do this show uh-huh. today. Uh, and the doctor calls, and there's nothing worse than um, the day after your exam when you get a call, and it's like the doctor wants to speak to you. Like, oh, that's great. Because you know me, I can't even watch, like, House. Oh, no, no, I'll do House. It gets me all paranoid. I think I have some disease. So uh, he calls and says, uh, he wanted to talk to me and leaves it on my message. So i got to call him back. And, you know, you're worrying the whole time. And he goes, I forgot to, to, to give you the prescription for your ears. Ears. Apparently, I have a waxy buildup <laughs> in my ears, a waxy buildup. Do you Q-tip when you get out of the shower? Yes, that's what I told him. And he goes, you're just making it worse. You're pushing it in. So I'm not tamping it with a cannon pole. I'm trying to, I, I, I use them. How are you supposed to use a goddamn uh, Q-tip? It's a muscular. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm shoving ammo in there and shooting at redcoats. What do you think I'm doing? You know, but... Uh, you're on to something. I think this is uh, preventing us from going deaf. Because I've had a hearing problem. I've <laughs> had a hearing crash. problem for Nothing. many, many years. I'll crash me in yeah, the mix. <laughs> uh, someone add a crash in. <laughs> they will. They will in, uh, in post. Of course, do it in post. In, what in you post say? Prod. I don't know. I can't hear myself. I have too much wax in my ears. <laughs> well, I'm after that one, apparently, it. you're lucky. <laughs> I didn't hear it this way. for that gag, Jimmy. Uh, no, but you're on to something because, uh, you know, I've had a hearing problem for many years. Now yep. I'm starting to think that uh, maybe there's a lot of wax in my ears, and I don't want it to, to be removed. See, th- I, I like the fact that it's protecting my ears because I turn up my headphones so loud. You turn them up way too loud, and that's the problem. See, with the volume... Your ears secretes the wax to protect the delicate eardrum and, and things in there. But you can't just have it in there because then when you're off the air, you're constantly going, what? I find myself doing that. What? What? I'm like, <laughs> what do you say? That old commercial where the old couple's watching a movie yeah. and the old codger's all mad because he can't hear it. He's got to turn to his wife who's just pissed at him, you know, because he keeps turning around. What? What do you say? What'd I can't say? hear the movie. So I got to put drops in my ears and then go to him. And what kind of... What kind of archaic uh, technique is used to pull wax out of your ear? Like, like a vice and a toilet snake. <laughs> <laughs> you made me pop your eye out <laughs> for ear wax. Yeah. Yeah. Well, so I got I got I got to do that. But uh, I, I'm thinking now if that's done, I'm gonna be able to turn my volume down. Mm-hmm. And maybe you could do the same. Uh, I'll look into it. I guess. He's, We're just gonna wait until it's three inches out of his ear. <laughs> right. Just this big tube of wax, <laughs> squishing your headphones in there and squeeze it out like peanut butter. Oh. Unless you come down and eat it, why not? <laughs> a contest. You got to get a contest. Picture, dude. Hey, you what? Yeah, I'm, go- I'm gonna. By the way, Jimmy, yeah. where were you? Oh, this is headquarters strip club. Yeah. Taking, uh, doing a, doing a. This action. early? Wow. No, I was doing a photo shoot. For, See, uh, we're not doing that gag anymore. Still trying to play it up. I know. No, it's, nothing. it's not working. For we're sure. sleeping as you listen to this. I'm gonna be on the cover <laughs> of Stepping Out. Oh, really? Are you? Tuesday, yeah. Sorry. Wow, coming out and now stepping out. <laughs> no, no, no. Oh, cut it out. <laughs> oh, yo, you're fresh. <laughs> what? Oh, sorry, wax. Stepping out magazine in, in New York yeah. City. That's real cool. Yeah, I actually like the club. I've never been to headquarters before, but there was a one girl who was really, really sexy that I did the shoot with. So I hope so. Yeah. Can yeah you... be awful. She was really fat. <laughs> Pictures of me kicking her and wanting my money back. <laughs> <laughs> Can you give the shot away? What? No, because I don't know which one we're going to use yet. Okay. I don't know which one we're going to use. They didn't do one for safety, did they? No, that's the one oh, you never good. fall for. Where yeah. They try to do it with the tranny commercial. Just do one without the trans for, for safety. I'm like, what, do you think I'm doing this 10 minutes? For no. safety, that's the one we're going to use. Of course it is. Only like the other right. ones Just me in my stupid robe. So you're down there, and was she uh, semi-clad or fully clad? Bikini. Or she was wearing bikini? Like a, bikini? Uh, thong. Yeah, she was really cool. Yeah. You don't see her face once. It was just a, no? Yeah, it was just her ass. She was oh. very sexy. Oh, that's ver- oh I, I can figure out what the shot's going to be. Yeah. yeah. Are you Are you ready for Letterman tonight? Cheek to cheek. Um, oh, tonight. Oh, it is tonight. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. See? That was good. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, Don't last night after the abominable hard... Hard uh, rock broadcast. <laughs> oh my God! We all no, no, see, see, don't get, don't confuse the people. We haven't done the 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 Halloween party yet. We're doing it in the morning here. See, we're still we're we're doing it. It's <laughs> see, happening right then, now. Oh, right. You're it, right, 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 right. No, you're as a matter of right. fact, if you're listening and you're in the New York area, show up. You'll get in <laughs> right. right now. We're partying hard at the Hard Rock Cafe. And the and the password when the bouncer tries to say there's no party is to say something really racist and push past them. <laughs> <laughs> um, but tonight, Letterman. That's really exciting for Jim Norton. Yeah, we'll see how it goes. Let's hope it's good. I think it'll go well. I You're a so funny too. man, and I have all the faith in the world. I had to email my song. They wanted to know what song I want to walk out to. Oh, what song you I don't know. I just said anything Sabbath, preferably Sabbath. Iron Man. 
I don't want to see Paul Schaefer doing Iron Man. What a dweeb I'm going to feel like. Yeah, because the band does it. Yeah. That might be a little weird. Yeah. Isn't Iron Man a little kind of too popular? You should pick something a little no, more. No, but you want people to know what it is because after five seconds, like you, people, nobody will recognize any of it, especially with a big band. Yeah, yeah. Playing like it, big so band you, sound. Like Dancing Queen? Everyone knows that. Well, Alba. that's kind of nice, but who can concentrate <laughs> on the jokes all that music? <laughs> <laughs> all right, we're backstage here at the Hard Rock Cafe getting ready for the Halloween party. We're going to do a lot of cool things tonight. Oh, uh, I, I mean this morning, wink, wink. Yeah, uh, we're doing pin the steak on Nosferatu. Pin the steak on Nosferatu. I saw this being tested at the ONA Institute. Yeah, well, the uh, lab. In the lab. The lab, uh, yes. At the Institute. I saw some of the interns working on uh, the pin the steak on Nosferatu. Nosferatu is one of our interns. Striking resemblance to Nosferatu. What did he come uh, uh, as? We're dressing him up as oh. Nosferatu. As Nosferatu. Oh, okay, good. You dress him as a live human. It takes nothing. What do you ha- would you have to darken up his skin <laughs> and clip his fingernails? Oh, they just got teeth for him. That's it. <laughs> just got teeth. Yeah, that's all they they needed to complete the costume. Yeah, I saw him working on some of those things. Uh, so, so they uh, you saw them practicing this in the ONA lab? Yeah. Yeah. They're using some type of bow and arrow device to deliver this uh, steak. Uh, to his heart. Okay. And I guess uh, if you get closest to the heart, which would kill Nosferatu, blah, 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 you win. Win a prize. How much? What do they get? I don't know. It's uh, like $300. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Cheap. Do you need- <laughs> How great would it be if you lost an eye? <laughs> <laughs> now that's worth 50 bucks. Drunk can have $50. No, it's... Uh... Oh, yeah, it is $50. I thought you guys $50. were kidding. $50. We got some great prize money this year for the for the show, but yeah. all right. They didn't win that contest. That's the throwaway contest, obviously. Yeah. And then we're doing bobbing for marital aids. Oh, Jesus. So we've got to keep it clean because we're on free Marital right now. aids. Yeah, it's a timed event for contestants. <laughs> yes, Jimmy? <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't think fast enough, but it's just Robert Reed I almost tripped over. <laughs> uh... <laughs> We got four contestants, two male, two female, in front of a table with clear Rubbermaid bins, each with ten, uh, uh, ten of these. Uh, marital aids. Ten of these. Yeah, these are things that perk up anyone's marriage, there you I go. believe, is what a marital a, aid would be. It's a rowboat. In, in shallow water. <laughs> cinder block. Supplied, tarpaulin. Supplied by MySexyStore.com. Hands behind backs. The contents, uh, contestants will attempt to, you know, uh, get as many in their mouth. It's like bobbing for way. apples, yeah. which is a traditional Halloween uh, event, only yeah. with uh, marital aids. But there is a twist, and is we can there? we can say the twist because no one's hearing this right now. They're out. Right. They're right. out in the Hard Rock Cafe. Uh, Than, what's the twist on the contest? Cow parts in the bins with the marital aids. Wait, what? Cow parts? Yes, uh, such as uh, I guess tongs, tongs hearts. Oh, like et meat. Yes. This is almost like a fear factor kind of thing. Exactly. So that's oh. really going to gross people out. Uh, that is disgusting. Floating in water? Yes. Uh, oh, so all the like life juices drain out and it just takes on this grayish white pale and tone. And they'll be blindfolded, so they have to really bite to find out if. <laughs> <laughs> that is, that Do is I have heinous. AIDS or something else? That is that's good. And they're not going to know yeah. that stuff's in there, obviously. No. And I'm hearing something about cream corn. That's news to me, but it sounds pretty good. Uh, I'm hearing they're going to throw a bunch of cream corn in the uh, the bin as well. So. And cream corn stinks under optimum circumstances. Yeah. All right. Optimal. What else we got? Optimum. Optimum. I don't know. We got a we got a candy eating contest. That sounds innocent. A times event. Innocent. It sounds a little too innocent. Yeah. A candy eating. Oh, until perhaps they um, eat up. too much candy and throw up. Then it's fine. <laughs> I don't know why Patrick Monaki eat candy until his toes just fall off. <laughs> like you want to hear plink like in Escape from Alcatraz and they threw the fingers on Mr. Zimmerman's desk? Yeah. <laughs> and then we got uh, the glue trap uh, mummy. That's the best shape I've seen him in. <laughs> yeah, no kidding. Uh, that That's Colin Quinn, isn't it? <laughs> it has to be oh, Colin is, Quinn. Is that, is that? Yeah, Colin oh Quinn has showed God. up in a costume. He's dressed as some type of uh, like medicine man. What what is An that? African medicine man. Wait wait, come here, come here. <laughs> he's Patrice's Patrice's doctor. doctor. He's dressed as some kind of like African med- medicine man. Why isn't everyone dressed in Halloween outfits? I thought it's Halloween. Well, we got some stuff, some uh, costumes. He's out there kidding all of us, you know. Been... <laughs> yeah. Except for the certain few that have to wear ankle bracelets and stay home tonight. Doesn't bring the kids out for them. Poor lads. Very good. Colin's here. Colin's here. We got Patrice O'Neill over there. We got Rich Voss over there. (laughs) Bonnie and Jaime. Right. We got a whole crowd back here. (laughs) What is he doing? What are you doing? (laughs) He's just a medicine man. I'm dressed in a Halloween costume I bought at Ricky's. 
Oh, oh. That's a good job. He's got a machete and a club. Booga, yeah. Booga. Hey, and uh, booga, booga. <laughs> yeah. Moving on, we got the glue trap mummy thing we're doing. Who, who can explain the glue trap mummy contest? Steve, you want to explain this? You don't know good radio when you see it. <laughs> <laughs> Let Steve explain it. All right, we have the glue trap mummy. Is we have a uh, basically glue traps that were donated. Those rat traps. I yeah. guess, uh, and we're going to have contestants uh, in a timed event uh, apply those to their bodies as quickly as humanly possible. And at the uh, fan, am I right? At the end of that that time, whatever it is, two three minutes, we're going to count how many they have on their body and see yeah. how many. But doesn't the winner have to rip them off or something? Yeah, there's a ripping off portion. There is um, a ripping off. That would have to be a ripping off oh, of the trap be portion because that takes skin, hair, everything with it. Right. That's going to be they wonderful. Uh, they they win lots nothing. of money. Do they win? It's it's a, just a That's cash like, thing. Yeah, three hundred fifty dollars for no, first first for prize. Bragging rights, the nerve of us. No yeah. cute prizes. Nothing. And then uh, we got the costume contest, which is always a favorite because it's costumes that have something to do with the Opie and Anthony show. Yeah. And then we got uh, Flavor Flav performing today. Yes. That is gonna be very very cool. The Flav. What's he gonna do? Huh? What's he doing? He's doing his new stuff. Patrice, why don't you grab a mic? Throw a mic over there. All the stuff that K-Fed doesn't do. <laughs> K-Fed. They had to cancel a bunch of K-Fed shows, apparently. Oh, it's a sh I yeah, love him. Ticket sales were a little down. <laughs> Oof. A little off. <laughs> yeah. yeah, no one appreciates it. <laughs> he's like the boss of uh, rap. <laughs> he's the wait, boss what? of rap? Wait, wait. <laughs> Colin. <laughs> What you say? I said, which voice is the K-Fed of comedy? <laughs> <laughs> Bonnie's like Britney. <laughs> He's basically a white trash kind of, you know, you're waiting to see the rat tail. Even if it's not there, you know it should be there. <laughs> what else? What else? Oh, I wish I could come up with something. Uh, yes. Mm -hmm. I like how you're really committed to the costume, and he's got like this uh, grass skirt on, but look, there's black jeans underneath. <laughs> but look what I have. Like, Boots. What did you just? I haven't put those on. It took me ten minutes of my gut. <laughs> <laughs> you cooked up uh, a white abuana in a pot and stole his jeans. If you people saw this costume, you'd know what great radio really is all about. <laughs> yeah, the visual hey, aspect see of it. Later, we're taking all sorts of pictures and video. Oh, it ends hey, up Rich, you got too. anything? No, no. <laughs> of course not. Grab a mic. And Nothing. Stay on. I'm rich. What's, what's going on? Kitty Happy Mike. Halloween. Kitty Mike. <laughs> Happy, <laughs> Kitty Happy Mike. Halloween. <laughs> what do you say? Happy what? Halloween. Oh, yeah. <laughs> What are we, five-year-olds that just knocked on your door, you idiot? <laughs> Happy <laughs> Halloween. Have some treats. <laughs> <laughs> Mommy, it was nice out. Why is it raining now? <laughs> uh, freaking red. <laughs> <laughs> hey, uh, did you check out the FHM magazine? It's what so you... cool, man. It's cool, right? Is, yeah. Did you see the magazine? Oh, Colin's not in it. No. Uh, well, well, this is going to be awkward oh, now. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> well, because we didn't have the, uh, the page space. Uh, Ooh. it's cool. Ooh. <laughs> Wait, get a mic on. <laughs> get a mic on Colin. He's killing and uh, no one's hearing him. Unfortunately, they're fighting with each other, so yeah. they can't share a mic. <laughs> Every time I see Bonnie, I'm waiting for her to go, you know what? This is it. I've had it with the marriage. <laughs> I guess you got to catch her after like four drinks when she's like, I can't do this much longer. <laughs> I thought he made more than 1400 a week headline. And the guy's been doing it for 25 years. What was that? Hush. Oh, man. Let me. Yeah, you're... I'm not killing you. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, if it lasts one month, that's two more weeks in your marriage. Oh. 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 That's uncalled for. Yeah. That's totally a lie. Yeah. Jesus Christ. That's totally a lie. You guys got divorced on a honeymoon. Oh. <laughs> that's Jesus. totally a lie. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Wait, <what>? <laughs> <laughs> that should have been like the tenth one in. <laughs> that was definitely a little too soon in the. Oh really? In the round. Yeah. Christ like, sakes. <laughs> that was old 1980s Tyson just <laughs> walked out and wow. <laughs> Could you eat? Want to put him on the canvas? Why don't you just make fun of how fat he's gotten? No. 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 <laughs> I just. <laughs> Who are, who, are, who are you for Halloween, Robert Kelly? I like that one. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> oh, now Rich is getting cocky. I don't mind being cocky. Who is Bob? He's getting confident now. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah, Bob is known to take it up a notch, isn't he? <laughs> <laughs> as much as he's taking his weight up to 290. <laughs> wow. Ooh.
But uh, Rich, it's good to see you. <laughs> what does Billy Berg get here? <laughs> uh, I'm joking, for Christ's sakes. <laughs> you guys really do worship that redheaded fool. <laughs> worship? I go, what time does he get here? Like, he's... No, forget it. <laughs> oh, boy, the star of YouTube. Screw him, too. I'm sick of his attitude. <laughs> star of YouTube? <laughs> I heard they had to pay him. Google had to pay him off when they bought the... <laughs> nothing? Nothing. Oh, nothing. <laughs> All right, listen. Bonnie, it's good to see you. I miss the girl in the corner at the Cure concert. But listen. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, <laughs> great radio. Too she bad it's not TV. adorable. Uh, she looks gorgeous, good. but it's a kind of a goth, depressed look. I wonder what that's from. <laughs> <laughs> I, I know where the depressed comes from. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> what did I do? She was in California, you know. Dating like alternative guys that she had she had free access to Zach Galifianakis's house anytime she wanted. Now she's in the back of like Jimmy's uh, Jimmy Reed's comedy alley outside of Demarest, waiting for this idiot to get off stage. <laughs> wow, you two are just brutal. Oh, it's gonna be a great night, man. It's just brutal to each other. All right, listen, we gotta take our first break. It's just mean. It's not even. Oh, no. It's not even good-natured ripping. No. <laughs> yes, it is. It's not personal nasty. It's Patrice is sitting there with the girl that's suing Benzino at Source Magazine. <laughs> <laughs> Patrice's girl. We see her once a year. Be nice. Yeah. He right, takes her out once a year on <laughs> Halloween. Helena. <laughs> listen, we gotta take a break. We got to take a break. Uh, when we get back, are we going to hit the stage? Is that what's going to happen? I think that's the plan or, of action. Or should we do another break from here? I would do this fun. all night long. <laughs> right. The thought of stepping in front of those animals. <laughs> yeah, we're going to figure it out. The... Hitchcock, what he wants to do. His body, look at him. He is shaped like a mystery director. <laughs> Oh, I really am finished. <laughs> oh, Colin, you are being hammered. <laughs> yeah, he's sitting right here. Here's... <laughs> Somebody gave him food. Three plates of food over to Colin. <laughs> <laughs> All right, the Opie and Anthony <laughs> Halloween Show is brought to you by Saw 3. If it's Halloween, it must be Saw in theaters everywhere. We're going to take a quick break. We might uh, do a little more from backstage or we'll hit the stage. We don't know Let's what's see going what on happens. Yet. We're at the Hard Rock Cafe. It's the ONA virus spreading across America. We'll be back with more of the 2006 Opie and Anthony Halloween Show live from the Hard Rock Cafe in New York City. Jim Norton will be appearing on The Late Show with David Letterman tonight on CBS. Check local listings for showtime. Opie and Anthony. Opie and Anthony. We now return to the Opie and Anthony Halloween Party from the Hard Rock Cafe in New York City. This is for you, Buttercup. Sponsored by Saw 3. All right, we're back with the Opie and Anthony Show, the ONA virus spreading across America. We're still uh, backstage at the Hard Rock Cafe getting ready for our Halloween party. And, uh... Yeah, we were going to go out, but then we said, uh, screw it. Yeah. Well, <laughs> Let's you stay know. back here a little we're longer. Well, the drinks arrived. Yeah. We got the Food. comfortable couch. Right. We're still waiting for, uh... Everyone else to show up, like Bob Kelly and I, I have Flavor Flav. He's playing later on. Yeah, the That's going to be a lot of fun. Is he here yet? Club Soda Kenny's uh, stuffing I, his face over there. I accidentally see la I last Halloween. Really well, I see a Bonnie Raitt video on. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> Colin's commenting on the bad videos that are playing. We saw Tears for Fears earlier. I know. We, we got to turn this down. The, in the, uh, the dressing room here, and it's all bad 80s video. So. I, uh, now, if you remember last year, we had the other dressing room, the smaller one. Yeah. Because uh, I guess uh, Hogan, Hulk Hogan was here. Right. And he got this big one. So I automatically went to the one we went to last year. And, and that's where Flav is staying. Who did I feel out of place? <laughs> oh, I walked in, and, and before I knew it, I was in the middle of the room, and I just went, Hi, gentlemen! <laughs> and then left. I'm so afraid. Why? Because I'm scared of black people. Is there a lot of them in there? Uh, well, you should have brought your Flav. Nazi paraphernalia. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> why, why, it's Halloween. Why dress like I do every day? <laughs> Yeah, you were reaching for the lights, and you realized the lights were on. Oops. <laughs> All right, so we got Rich Voss. You're going to go out into the crowd yeah. and see what kind of costumes we got? Go see what we got out here, yeah. All right, start yeah, walking, Rich Voss. This should be mediocre. <laughs> I know. <laughs> we bring you calm. I'll forget it. Oh, shut up. Man, Colin Rich, is just shy. now wrapped yeah. around Bonnie. That's all right. That's right. I want to save her from the awfulness of voice. <laughs> She's very depressed. She's not depressed. She's as happy as she ever was. I know you do, but we're just you look like you did when you were 13. Oh, there's a security costume right here. Oh, he's a security guard. Wow, it's really Nothing. loud out it's, there. You can barely oh, hear anything. Can you hear any of this? Yeah, there we go. Uh, 
We have a. Uh, hold on, we got this guy. What? What? What's your name? Steve. Steve, what are you? I'm a larper. I don't know. He really looks like having Camden. He's a larper. He looks like a gladiator. He's a, he's like a gladiator that you know, just eats candy That's all day. Look how you're too fat to be a gladiator. I'm sorry. I can't hear. It's hard to hear. Oh, hold on. We got a black ninja. Why are you even wearing a costume? Because I'm the black ninja, man. This is so cool right here. These guys got all black on. Hold on. He's got all black on, and just his eyes are showing. I'm going to talk to you about this. I'm a black ninja. F face right here. What's no, your name? I'm saying, Kevin. you know, if I have some diabetes, if I go to diabetes. Hey, how you doing? Uh, uh, look at it. Oh, this is cool. I can't, I can't sell, say this stuff. No. This guy. You can't say that. You got to see. This guy's like a, what is this, a toilet? Oh, not so tender sentiments. This is a good one right here with a Norton uh, picture on it. This is a good costume right here. I, I can't say this on the air. Uh, How long do we leave Rich out there to hang? I, don't know. I know this is hang himself. This is killing me. Don't leave it out. All right, this is nice. Keep it. Yeah. Oh, that one's good. I can't Welcome say this. What's that? Well, Rich, hint around to it. He can't hear anything. I can barely he can't hear say anything. Almost, you can't hear or say anything. He's, hold on, Rich. Wait, Rich, wait, wait, wait. No, this is a good one. Hold on. Dumbest guy I know. Oh, look. <laughs> What's up? What's your name? Josh. Yeah, Josh, you got a rat trap up. You're uh, a bit okay. What you are is a big thing that would be on Norton or Collins' chin at night. I can hear what you said, but I said yes. <laughs> no one can hear him. <laughs> no one can hear me. Wow. Thank God they can't hear I, you. You know yeah. what? Listen, how's it going? Are we having a we having a? Uh, He's gonna dodge you a little kid for money. We got an Arabic guy right here. I guess. What are you, a terrorist? Yeah, you still dodging a kid for money, boss? Yes. We got club soda Kenny here. We got a lot of cool outfits out here. I gotta say it. Bonnie, There's you some... should be getting a telegram soon that That's... your husband has died out there in the crowd. It's uh he's he's bombing. I'm not bombing, I'm doing what I can. I can't hear. You got you know what I'm getting sick of sent to the wolves. We are sent... sorry to inform you. Oh my god, of the look loss at this. Come here, what's your, your husband, name? Rich Voss. What's your he, name? He was getting big laughs and then he walked behind the stem and freeway your... sign. You got it you remember me? It's hard to do. Uh, we got some dancers out here. We got some strippers out here. <laughs> strippers with costumes. What are the odds? Colin. Right. Colin is. Uh, I'm heading Dustin. Out. This is horrible. I'm going Dustin back in. Dustin. He's got a machete and a club. <laughs> right, Colin's <laughs> heading out. Uh, this, this is brutal. You're doing good, Rich. Ah, oh, it stinks. I'm coming back. Oh, you're killing. You're killing. Rich. <laughs> I can hear everything. It's fine. <laughs> Can you hear this? All right, wow. Oh, we got a big crowd. I'm going to do what Rich just did. Oh, this is really cool. There's some people. What? He's just reporting facts. <laughs> there's a floor and a ceiling. Yeah, there's a nurse over there who I really want to rape. Uh, <laughs> all right, this is anticlimactic. It is. A bunch of people looking expectantly at an empty stage. What a disappointment they're in for. <laughs> I know. You know how happy it makes me? There's so many not-so-tender sentiments. You dress like a box of tennis tenements. Oh, oh this is right. fantastic. You guys are missing quite a party out here. Yay! <laughs> wow. Picture picture one complete nothingness with just a lot of people doing it. Yay! It's going to stage. And the good thing is none of them have to get up early for work Let's tomorrow. That's great. Now we are gonna have to go out there, okay? Yay! Yeah. It looks like kinda, uh, said, we were having fun back here. And then uh, we realized we're going to have to address the crowd. Hey, we sent a recon party out, and now we realize hey. the mercenaries Look, the nurses. Oh, have yeah. to go out there and save oh, us and, oh, and, and really entertain a crowd. Yeah. Wow, wow, look at this one. What a lovely girl. These are the strippers from New wow. Jersey. Wow. I don't think she's a real nurse. She's not a real nurse. All right, well, this yelling sucks. Let's go inside. Oh, oh, they yelling at boss. Hold on. Oh, you talk to the girls, Colin. Colin. What are you going to say to them? Colin, yeah, what are you going to say, Colin? You got something to eat? Exactly. Why all the fat jokes? I don't, I don't know. know. Why all the fat jokes? We're done. Yeah, that was fun. He that was a uh, nice. show about his eating. It's called Remote Lack of Control. <laughs> 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 all right. I don't know uh, how much we're going to use of that. Uh, you guys that was magic. Yeah, it, was, it, it was awful. There's <laughs> nothing you could do. All right, we're gonna no, just too loud and. Uh, there's no, you can't get any conversation. What, what, what's what's the feel of the people out there? Are they yeah. intoxicated? Are they're they? Um, but they seem, you know, they seem like they're uh, normal. They're not out of control yet. 
They're not at the Billy stage, you know what I mean? They are expecting uh, us to get out there and... They're just looking at the stage. Oh, yeah, of course. They know what it is. They're just looking here for at JD and stage. Elvis. They came for you two. Yeah, of course. <laughs> All right, we're going to break. I think we're going to start the party next. Yeah, it's going to be a lot of fun. I mean, just from our little step out into there, we could just see the magic. It's going to happen. <laughs> wow. Wow. And now Earl just walked in. Things are being kicked up into another gear. We had to test the water. And Ron and Fez. Ron and Fez. Uh, hey, Ron and Fez. Ronnie's wearing a patch over his eye. Yeah, very nice. Who uh, who who are you with the patch? I uh, nobody. Just a guy who got uh, <laughs> stuck in the eye. You're like a uh, casual pirate. And thank you very much. Now Fezzy's here. Oh, do no. not call him Matt Foley. Oh, a lot no. of people have made that mistake. Oh, well, you're looking more and more like Sam Kinison. Thank right? you very much. <laughs> I, I but that was Sam after Kinison he died. Right. <laughs> after he died. Oh my and God, Fezzy. Fezzy. All right, what are we on now? Are we on satellite or terrestrial? Uh, this is uh, terrestrial. All right, so I can't say what I wanted to tell you. But yeah. I'll just say the women have improved. Oh, okay. Since last year. Oh, yeah? All yeah, right. A lot that's of hot good. women. Now, that's good to know. I yeah. know. It's really going downhill. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> You're the rub age now. Uh, and I know I know we have one of these contests tonight. We want Fezzi involved for the dunking, for the bobbing. Oh, oh bobbing? Oh, bobbing, yeah. bobbing for marital, marital age. There you go. I didn't know what that's to call it. Is that how we say it? Age. Yeah. Yeah. Why? What? <laughs> what did Colin say? <laughs> He is He's not, doing a Matt Foley joke. He is on not him. Matt Foley. <laughs> Look at that. Matt I'm Clark Kent. He's I'm Clark not Matt Kent. Foley. He's got the little spit curl. <laughs> and I know. This, this is the other thing. One year since Fez had his heart attack. I know because I, open your shirt up. Let me see what that says. That is actually Stent Man. <laughs> yeah. It is. <laughs> We talked about that already. Yeah. Yes, it was yeah. a year ago that uh, that Opie was blamed for uh, your heart attack. Exactly, yeah. the That's stress. Going to lay back this time. Well, no one Relax. Happened. No pressure. No exactly. pressure. This year. We didn't year. really right. explain this during the first break. We uh, decided to hang out backstage for a really long time, and Ron and Fez were supposed to fill. Right. And we told them, ah, 15. They were the new kids on the block. We're like, sure. we're like 15, 20 minutes. <laughs> Again. We'll be out there. Don't worry. Like two hours later, like we're getting notes. Uh, uh, Fezzi is uh, freaking out. He's uh, sweating and having chest pain. And we're please. like, we're just sitting back here doing Jaeger shots. <laughs> right. <laughs> is there any way to get them on stage? His left arm is going numb. And we're like, ah, another shot. Leave him out there. Last year, I've taken the precaution to step on the Coke. So don't worry about <laughs> it. <laughs> okay, you stepped on it. Mainly it's Manitol. At this Maybe laxative? Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That'll that'll do the trick because <laughs> you, you, obviously you can't take the uh, and, pure and stuff. And Foster no. actually went. I don't care. I'll still do some. Right? <laughs> <laughs> you tell him it's cut with Clorox. Doesn't matter. I'm no, still no. ready. Yeah, hey. Boss just made that universal signal for two in the bathroom. Yeah, right. Follow yeah, yeah. Hey, hey, he touched his nose. No, touched your nose. <laughs> you guys walked through the crowd. Give us the yeah. feel. We haven't been out there yet. Uh, Rich press. Boss tried and it, he failed press. miserably. Oh, yeah. Whoa, whoa, whoa! I didn't fail. The audience failed. Was that your teeth swelling out there? <laughs> Jeez, that's not right. What's the feel out there, Ron? I thought he was dressed like the uh, Berlin Wall. I, I will say this. For an o and gig, I never saw so many beautiful women. I don't know whether you guys I don't know what happened. hired them or brought them in. Or... Well, we cut down on the uh, the sex jokes. Oh, and I And when see you do that, it, it seems like women want to listen to your radio show. So we went from yeah. sex to domestic These violence. These are good-looking women, too. This yeah. isn't Fatty Pig Fatty crowd no, out no, here. No. No, this is a good-looking crowd. I know. I don't year. understand it. Huh? You've turned everything around. I think so, yeah. Thank God for John Minnelli. Oh, Seriously, just hey, take a time. It's right? just the day's yeah. time. I want to welcome you guys uh, also back to the airwaves of uh, CBS Radio right now. Wow, I had no idea. What an announcement. <laughs> that is fantastic. Is, uh, <laughs> <laughs> Somebody's sweating in the corner right now. <laughs> We're honored. You're, you're on right now. I mean, that's wow, uh, yeah. the guy with who the, knows. The guy with the tie is hanging himself right now. Right, <laughs> him out Two days on out. the job, and he's hanging himself with his own tie. <laughs> So You're hot welcome. women out there, unbelievable. Nice hot. costumes, yeah. Or? Yeah, everybody looks that slutty Halloween look. So you're, yeah. you're pulling it off. Any uh, any Ron and Fez costumes out there? Because I know a lot of that. We have a lot of crossover audience. Is that right? Yeah. yeah. I didn't know. I Is there a big right, stupid so. uh, Dave uh, costume? Oh or? yeah, there'll be a couple of those. A couple of those. But you guys have changed so much in one year. I can't believe this was a sausage festival last year. Oh, I know. Ugliest guys <laughs> slam dancing to really bad music. This year, you're going in a whole new direction. It's classic. Yeah, you got to take the bad with the good. Yeah. Oh, by the way, Letterman's here. So be on. Oh, 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 oh. Well, do I set for the crowd? I'm sure appreciate it. <laughs> yeah. I'm sure Five clean minutes. <laughs> <laughs> We're very excited. Jimmy does Letterman tonight. 
Tonight's the night, huh? Yeah, yeah. tonight. Well, don't yeah. confuse me. Tonight. No, it's oh, tonight. Oh, wait, it's tonight. It's tonight. tonight. Let's yeah. just go with it. It's tonight. How's you guys? Thanks for getting up so early and coming in, too. Well, we, you know, we felt we had to, so we're taking off tomorrow. Because you can't be in by noon. No, of course not. All right, <laughs> Bob Kelly has arrived. What's up, hey, Bob? Hey there, Bobby. What are you dressed as, a failed comedy tour? Wow. Oh, I, I, wow. I really don't like the fact that you've been waiting. Wow. I've been here for 10 oh, minutes and you've been waiting 10 minutes, minutes to say that. out of that one. Oh, my God. Wow. He's what? just waiting for his spot. Oh, <laughs> shortest comic standing. <laughs> <laughs> He's just mean, Bob. <laughs> wow, way to hurt someone when they walk in the door. <laughs> yeah, right, they they walk in, he he in. just trundled in, and you got to start with him right away. Don't I say the word trundle. I'm sorry, I'm just saying you walked, you came in. What are you? What are you doing? What are you Why doing? Are you in a sketch comedy group now? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's called Torgasm. <laughs> oh, oh, oh my God! Pesci <laughs> had a better welcome at the end of Goodfellas. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. I think Voss secretly hates me. I, I, He's I, jealous. I'm not going to take jealous. your seat. <laughs> you can. <laughs> He's too small. He's jealous of the big money what? you made on the tour. What are you talking about? He's jealous. Huh? What? Yeah, what money? jealous of what? Tour I didn't guys? say he was jealous. Colin, I don't oh, need you to stick jealous. up for me. I can Take the freaking mask off, you deaf old man. <laughs> uh-huh. <laughs> That's okay. I don't like... I, th I actually thought you had a fake torso, and that's actually your real chest. We hit him with that as soon as he came in. Gosh, yeah. Really? Yeah. You think a room yeah. full of comics would miss that? Yeah. Come on. Yeah. That I'll tell you what, Bob. That was what? said. What? That's I, not, I'll, I guarantee you, I'll give you whatever I have in my pocket financially if that's not a double XL. It's what, all right. Okay. Everything you have right. in your pocket. You know, you're yeah. actually empty empty $30 and Burger King coupons. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what happened? Dane needed his coattails for his costume tonight. <laughs> Pretty good. Pretty rich, fucking... It's funny when Anthony does that was, it. That was pretty good. Oh, Bob, that hurt. I'm surprised you didn't do it in a voice. Let's <laughs> <laughs> uh, go toe-to-toe, -to -toe, huh? Hoo-hoo, <laughs> hoo-hoe. You can't go toe-to-toe -to -toe -toe with you. Toe-to-toe, yeah. yeah. <laughs> How about... I can't see my toes. I got my own joke. Listen, I'm back to the Queen of England, Colin Quinn. <laughs> Wow, Anthony got greedy. Like Bobby Kelly I, on a I hunger strike. It, <laughs> <laughs> I think it's greedy. <laughs> With AIDS. You're standing right next to the bathroom. Are you going to go visit your career? Oh! oh Rich Moss oh. with another one. Wow. I have to bring my girlfriend with me to make money. Oh! Oh, oh shit. Oh, no, you're dead. You're, 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 you're the one. You're dead. Oh, he did. Sorry. 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 I should have said wife. I'm sorry, Bobby. <laughs> It worked for you, just in case. <laughs> Bonnie had a glimmer of hope, thinking, wow, I'm not married to him? <laughs> Can I say something important? Yes, uh, Colin Bobby, Quinn. Bobby looks like a last-minute gift at the Beijing airport. <laughs> <laughs> That's really good. Wow. Oh. 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 Oh, 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 geez, oh, sad. There it is. Wow. You know, you it's know, a whole dynamic. You got your highs and your lows. Yeah, well, we were having fun, and but the low. You didn't get it. Now, because of you, we got to punish the audience with commercials. Oh, thanks, Rich. Yeah. <laughs> Jesus, it was going so roll. well. I just saw that sweaty handle hit the brake. <laughs> Sparks flying out of the train wheels. <laughs> All right, we we got to put on a show for these freaks outside. Yeah, so. I guess we're going to have to go out there. Huh? <laughs> we're going to take a break. We'll hit the stage at the Hard Rock Cafe next. It's the ONA virus spreading across America. It's the Opie and Anthony show live from the Hard Rock Cafe. The ONA virus spreading across America. We're at the side stage. That curtain's going to go up in a few minutes. They're chanting Opie yeah, and Anthony. Chant. There it is. I'm just getting my uh, my cake together. They have no idea. Oh, I'm going to ruin my shoes. Just throw the plastic on it. Oh, I don't give a crap. I'll ruin my shoes. Here. I'm gonna All right, here we go. You'll get some plebe to yeah. Yeah, I don't care. Is this on? This yeah. is on. Is this on? Yeah. If you can hear me, cheer or boo. They could kind of hear you. Can All you right, open me? that curtain. All right. What is up, Hard Rock Cafe?
They want the cake. There you go. Welcome to the Hard Rock Cafe, the OP Anthony show. I got I got cake all over my fucking shoes. You guys want to see Anthony? Come on out, Anthony. That was a really bad I idea with the cake. Be. Too damaged. Too damaged. Too damaged. I smite thee. You shall not pass. <laughs> that was a bad idea with the cake. I'll try to spell that cake away. Oh, it looks like what you left in the bowl this morning <laughs> or yesterday, dog. <laughs> oh, this stage a mess. Yeah, that was a really dumb idea. Also, I got to throw my T-shirt out there. All right. Oh, the cake. Oh, the first wow in the front row. Very nice. Here you go. Amazing. A Paul R. Nelson campaign wow. T-shirt. We got a mystery guest, Hard Rock Cafe. A mystery guest. Special mystery guest. Very scary. Let's bring him out. Here he is, You'll our mystery guest. Special mystery uh, guest. Who will be uh, joining uh, us. Uh, He's so scary. Too damaged. Too damaged. They'll never guess my identity. They'll never guess my identity. Sniffle age joke. Sniffle age joke. <laughs> and uh, wow, you know, Ron and Fez were absolutely right. Wow, wait. What a beautiful wow. crowd. We got some hot women here at the Hard Rock Cafe. <laughs> oh, those are lovely. Girls. We got girls wow, and we got the, <laughs> the Robert yeah. Reed mask. Look at Robert Reed. He's a skeleton. <laughs> And he's got a, a bowl full of broth. What a good boy. <laughs> wow. Oh, very nice. We got baby yeah. girl in the front row wowing. Lots oh, is that of pictures being taken for the website. Oh, very nice. Oh, now oh, she's making now out. she's making oh, out. Oh, I hate when that happens, Anthony. Anthony. This is just an amazing sight. We didn't have this last year. No. Oh. It was just a sausage fest last year. Absolutely. And now beautiful girls. Unbelievable. We got happy typing girl in the front row. So yeah, a lot nice of the crowd. pal talk people I see. God damn, we got a lot of hot women. Oh, we got a nurse. <laughs> they just figured out who the mystery guest is. They didn't know I was the mystery guest. <laughs> Are you kidding me? <laughs> Which one of you dumb bastards didn't know it was Jimmy? You know what it is? Huh. You are a naughty nurse, aren't you? You know what? Why don't we get some of these hot girls on stage? We've got a chocolate cake. Uh, something can happen. Some, <laughs> something any girls want to come happen. on stage? Who, who wants to come on? A little, uh, little wow. Wow, wait. Lift up. Oh, goodness gracious, Jimmy. Hey, miss. There Rich, you go. Would you do that on my chest? <laughs> All right. We got a couple of the hot girls on stage here. She will not make a copy of the cake on your chest, Jimmy. We got a naughty nurse on stage. Lovely. Oh, uh, look, we have to have a cake cleaner upper. Yeah, he's not too happy. Wow, just lovely girls coming up. All right, they're wowing uh, the crowd. Come on up, girls. You can make it. Help baby girl up. <laughs> nice. Oh, my goodness. Oh, God. I think these girls Jesus been... H. Christ. Drinking all day. She is lovely. Wow. Oh, Very my nice. God. Don't slip. Very nice. Don't slip. That would break my effing heart. There you go. Oh There's a goodness. photo op for everybody. Here it comes. Here's your photo op. It is, wow. It is Whip Em Out Wednesday. There you go. Five really hot girls on stage flashing the crowd here at the wow. Hard Rock Cafe. No, no, no. Don't whip me. We got a dominatrix on stage. She went right after me. You know, I really feel like the show is picking up steam and back where it belongs. Because last year, I think we got... One breast exposed. Wow. Yes, and that's because Olivia Newton John showed up. Wow, <laughs> <laughs> oh, the crowd is in a frenzy. Whip Anthony. them out. Oh, why They're not? They're out. What else? Wow. Look at these girls. <laughs> these girls are just. Are, they don't care. They actually listen to our show. I'm not used to. Hot girls listening yeah. to uh, the program. The hell is going on? Very nice. All right. Oh, I love very it. Very good. Welcome, everybody. All right, let's get the girls off the stage so we can start the broadcast. Yeah. Actually, we are broadcasting. All right, ladies. Thank you, ladies. Thank you, girls. Keep drinking and um, keep drinking. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to give these people a real thrill. That's yeah. right. Do you guys want to see something really sexy? 
Oh boy, Jimmy is going to moon the crowd, and there it is. Another, Another photo, photo op. op. Lots of photo oh. ops tonight at the Hard Rock Cafe, Anthony. He has smited me with his hairless bottom. <laughs> I must two damage, two, two damage. damage, two damage, two damage. All right, all right. Uh, what do you want to do next? You want to do the song from Club Soda Kenny to welcome everybody? You know something? What a great wow. welcome on this Halloween party. We've yeah, been out right. here. We've been out here three minutes, and we're doing the Kenny song already. Of course. Oh, why not? We are finished. Because it's a great way to open up the show, relax the crowd. Uh, uh, it's a seasonal song, and he's so good at doing it. Yeah. It, it's the Monster Mash. It's the Monster and, Mash. And uh, it's uh, uh, supposedly a, a graveyard smash. It's the second hit from Club Soda Kenny. Yeah. The follow-up to Secret Agent Secret Man. Secret Agent Man. Uh, here is Kenny's costume. Which well, you have Kenny's costume. His face, he, right now, he looks thrilled to be putting this on. <laughs> <laughs> but he's putting it on in front of everybody. It should be kind of in the back so they don't know who he is. Well, uh, look, you know. look, now we'll turn around and they'll, they won't know. I can't believe he's no longer a police officer. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Club Soda Kenny's about ready to do it. Wow, they're not happy with me with the cake. No, I'm, I'm going to try to look at uh, some more of the crowd here. Yeah. Wow. Unbelievable. Hey, you made it. That's it. There's some great costumes out there. Nice. It's so good to see some of these girls, and they're not in little two-inch squares on Pal Talk, and they have real breasts. It's amazing they're and like wonderful. real girls. All right, Club Soda Kenny Ann is ready for his Monster Mash song. All right, how are we going to do this? Uh, well, there's a... What are you dressed as, Debbie? That's Happy Typing Girl. What are you? What is she dressed as? I don't know. They're all Opan's oh, oh, angels. Oh, very nice. They're, they're crime like that. fighters yeah. that fight crime with their uh, genitalia. <laughs> uh, I see Monster Mash is ready to okay. go on the karaoke machine. We have karaoke here. All right. Uh, oh, does that mean? Does that mean later on I might have to do some Neil Diamond? No. Neil Diamond tonight. Oh Anthony. my God! Imagine me doing Neil Diamond dressed as a wizard. Oh my God! All right. Hey, look at my wizard sleeve. Look at my wizard sleeve. It looks like some girls you see on Pal Talk. Oh, Jim, you, miss. Jimmy likes them like this. What? Loose. The inside of the sl wizard sleeve, nice and big and loose. <laughs> <laughs> You guys ready to hear Club Soda Kenny or what? Yes. All right, Kenny. Why don't you say hi to the crowd first, Kenny? Hello, everyone, and thank you for coming to the Hard Rock for this Opie and Anthony and Little Jimmy Halloween party. And now you will hear my rendition of Monster Mash. Club Soda Kenny, everyone. He looks ridiculous. He's standing in front of that yes. monitor like a retard in he front of a Ferris wheel. He did before the costume went on. It's an A4-inch intro. What does that mean? Uh, it, you'll see the words. It's almost yeah. like follow the bouncing ball. Then you can monster mash. And do the graveyard smash. You're going to do it all day. You'll clutch on in a flash. And then you can monster mash. Oh, monster good. You and Peter Stone are monster good. Mm -hmm. Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Thank you! Thank you! Thank you, I said. Club Thank Soda you. Kenny, everyone! Club Soda Kenny! Club Soda Kenny! He didn't even sing it, he just did it like it was spoken word. Yeah. Just reading it. Oh. Did you guys see the Club Soda Kenny guy in the audience? Yeah, bring him on stage real fast. He put more emotion reading the Miranda rights to someone he just worked over. <laughs> <laughs> this guy has a Club Soda Kenny, like, uh, oh, it's like a costume. Yeah. Uh, he's oh. got the suit. And Sam hair. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, come here, Kenny. This is a photo op for everybody. We got the wow, real Club Soda Kenny. Wow. And a Your guy that's the same height as Club Soda Kenny. Yes. Now, sir... Sir, uh, uh, what, what's with the, um, the, the hair you got on? It's Spanish moss by Club Soda Cigars and Scotch. Cause now, now, because Kenny has the driest hair ever. Thank you, that's right. 
Wow, he sounds like you too. That's pretty good. And uh, you, you have this wonderful mask of Kenny. Looks just like him. Oh boy. This gets cut out. <laughs> this gets cut out. This gets cut out. <laughs> Free FM will be supplying the prize money for tonight's Halloween costume party. <laughs> All right, very nice. Uh, thank you, sir. Thank you. All right. Wow, your hair feels moist and delicious compared to usual. All right, there you go. Should we take another break then and introduce we'll, the uh, comedians here? We'll take a break, introduce everybody, take a seat, and continue on with the festivities. All right, it's the only virus spreading across America. Uh, they're mopping the stage, Anthony. Yes, it was a uh, quite the mess. It was uh, a really stupid idea. I decided to come on stage with a cake. Why? I earned that cake. A I earned cake. that cake. And uh, look at my shoes, by the way. Look at my shoes. Yeah, your shoes. Uh, oh, Jesus Christ. Keep them away. Keep oh, them away. Oh, Kenny! Oh, oh Kenny! No. Kenny is to uh, go get your effing shine box. Oh, Kenny! Here Kenny is now cleaning Opie's shoes. You chop his strawberries for him <laughs> in the morning, and now you're cleaning chocolate off his shoes. But he's the perfect guy because he has such OCD. I mean, I know they're going to come back like They spotless. must get squeaky clean <laughs> for, for GH. GH needs clean shoes. All right. Oh, my God, the debauchery that's going on in the front row of that audience. These yeah. people are, these, Holy mackerel. These people are so hammered. Oh, and they started chants that uh, were unacceptable for broadcast. Well, it happens. We'll see what happens. I don't know what's going to make the air and what's not going to make the air. It'd be funny air. if Al didn't catch that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, oops. Yeah, well, what happened was, because I, I don't know if we made the radio, we had Club Soda Kenny do Monster Mash. I, I believe that made the radio. Oh, it was beautiful and rendition. Then there was someone out in the audience that was dressed just like Club Soda Kenny, so we thought to bring him up on the stage and have him meet and talk a little bit. And in the middle of the uh, conversation, yeah. the chant started. Yeah. There was an F chant and a C chant, right? Ooh. Look at Bob Kelly coming out, just uh, introducing himself to the ladies. Yeah. Walks right out to the girls. Look at him. There Work in the crowd. High-fiving. Weren't we going to introduce these guys? Well, he decided to just walk out. They're getting impatient. Get out, Dad! Oh, Dad! Get out, Dad! Get out, Dad! Get out, Dad! Get out, Dad! All right, we should introduce uh, some of our some of our friends to this uh, this madhouse yes. at the Hard Rock Cafe. Who oh, are we introducing first? Oh, thank you. My shoes are clean. Your shoes are all clean now? Oh, my God. Perfect. Oh. Thank you, mister. Oh. Well, I see um, the wonderful Mr. Colin Quinn. Yeah, we should give these guys a wireless mic, introduce them, and let them, you know, kind of yeah. kind of address the crowd. Say hi. Hey, Steve, we got a wireless mic for these guys. Yeah, we got one. All right, Hard Rock Cafe. Let's hear it for Colin Quinn. Oh, Thank you, folks. Oh, what a lovely, lovely night it is. You're supposed to address the crowd, Colin. What's the matter? You're supposed to uh, address the crowd a little bit. We need you to do 20 All minutes. All right, folks. What a, lovely, <laughs> what a lovely, lovely night it is. I don't like to compete, but I might go for first call. You can't hear them through that mask. No. No different yeah. than normal. <laughs> it's actually preferred. <laughs> Well, folks, don't tell me that I suck, because I'm not like Billy Burr. I can't take it. <laughs> that guy's off the hook. <laughs> All right. Well, that was wonderful, Colin. Thank you. Thanks, Opie. Uh, let's, uh, let's say hi to Rich Boss, everyone. Rich Boss. Yeah. Give Rich the wireless mic. Rich. Boss, stand up. Rich wow. Boss. How cool is this? Not particularly. Oh, and hey, huh? Jesus, boss, I'm gonna go deaf. Good one. Boss, they're all chanting Jew. Boss, that girl wants to show you her breath. Oh, is that what it was? What's happening to I us? Understand she can't look bodies backstage, she's not allowed to look. I didn't understand what they were chanting. Yeah. I thought they saw his teeth and were just saying chew, chew. <laughs> like use those things for something. <laughs> you, got, you got anything for this crowd, Rich? Uh 
Jude, Jude, wow, this is Jude, Jude. Jude. Welcome to the Halloween party at Auschwitz. Auschwitz, here. Auschwitz, Auschwitz. All right, very nice. <laughs> if Boss exposes his teeth Sorry, too Anthony. long, I don't want to steal your material. Their tags on it. <laughs> <laughs> All right, who else we got backstage? Who else we got? Uh, I don't know. How about a hand for uh, where's Patrice? Where's, where's Patrice? Patrice? Where's Patrice? Reprimanding his girl. Uh, Bob Kelly walked out. He thought it was his intro. Yeah. Patrice. Patrice. Oh, yeah, Patrice. Give Patrice, Patrice the word of the fight for a second. Patrice, address the crowd, will you? Patrice, look at that. Thank you very much. Excellent. <laughs> All right. <laughs> wow. Free FM. Might as well I move think they're this. they're just fascinated that I mean, you're no, bigger than no, uh, all the other said, people. I don't think they said bigger. I think they said yeah. N word and no, N nice. No, they're saying bigger. Because because yeah, and, and the Kimbe Matumbo are not going to put Colin him in came out and then Rich and then you're the bigger of the uh, three, so I they were saying been bigger, banned bigger. From all O and A events for a year. <laughs> what? All right. Oh, that's no, yeah. it's not going to happen. You got it. Yeah. What a nice sensitive audience. Ooh. Being shot by the lovely ladies, they have guns. And next we have a uh, we have a, a man who's uh, floor cleaning products I've enjoyed for years. How about a nice hand for Bob Kelly? Bob Kelly, <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Clean. <laughs> Get out, Dad. Hey, look at those Dan Patrice. Look at those. Can I have little, a little fucking room. Look at those little raw eggs, just for you, Bobo. Oh, those are fucking. Where are they? Perfect. Oh, All right, right there. Wait. Baby girl. Look at, look at the over here. There is the hottest girl on girl action oh, going. Yes. Fun, man. Give a big hand. Wow. Yes. Oh. Give, a big hand. Give a big hand for those <laughs> strippers. Man, this need to yell at Bobby because he's everything. <laughs> <laughs> Mongrel. Mongrel. <laughs> <laughs> Who else we have back there? Otto? Is Otto back there? Otto and George? Yeah. Yay. Wow. Where's Otto? Otto. Where's Otto? Wow. Where's Otto? There you go. There you go, sweetie. He's wiping his nose. All right, well. Uh, George, George, not, George demanded things on his rider that he didn't get any left. And those those breasts aren't even a cup. Wow, look at the one he's sitting on the shoulders there. Look at Nurse Betty back there. How hot it is. Wow. Wow. Fantastic. Fantastic. Oh, he's Fantastic. still going to have sex Hey, listen, if here. it's smaller than an A, where does it go? Ooh, the lowercase. <laughs> look at that. All right, are we going to start the first look at these animals? Uh, have you been looking though, and and kind of seeing any prospects for the uh, costume contest? Uh, yeah, I'm looking. Do you see the um, Flavor Flav over there? You know who that is? Yes. Do you know who that is? Who's that? See Flavor Flav? Yeah. Do you, rapper do you, we have. you know who that is? No. Oh, Take I, a good look at him. Uh, now I know. I, I could tell just by it's no filter Paul. No filter Paul. Flavor Flav. Wow. Flavor Flav. That is a good job. He might man. win the costume contest. That really is. Good. He did a really good job. Damn it, I can't, I did not know, I thought that was an act, swear to God, I thought that was a black guy. It's Flava Flav if he ate the rest of the guys in the band. Ladies and gentlemen, oh no filter God. ball is Flavor Flav. Hey, you That's got a good, good shot at winning the costume contest, buddy. You certainly do. Definitely got a good shot at it. He's Something tells me he's very good at putting on blackface. He does it at home in private and then curses <laughs> himself in the mirror. It's the only way his wife will touch him. <laughs> I like the I like the fact that he kept his St. Patrick's Day hat to answer yeah. the costume. You could have got a nicer hat for the Halloween show. Wow, the Paul sucks champ is going. That's right. You hey, can't curse. You can't curse, you ass. He's so fat he had to use a grandfather clock to make him look the right size <laughs> around his neck uh, because I didn't explain it right. Hold on. Uh, I, Hey, we got a uh, we got a surprise for everybody. A Ooh. night of surprises. Thank Ooh. you, No Filter Paul. Yeah, Paul. Go after yourself. Wait, what's that called? Not so tender. Not sentiments. so tender sentiments. Not so tender it is idiot. sentiments. Uh, read one of them. What does it say? I can't read from here. Well, Some vagina. No one can read. There's no mic. All right, all right, all right. We'll, we'll get, get to that. that. We'll get to you. We'll get to that. Your no vagina days. smells like. <laughs> Your vagina <laughs> smells like vomit. Your vagina smells like vomit. Yeah. All right. Three times. times. We got a special guest for the Hard Rock Cafe, a night of surprises. Ladies and gentlemen, get your cameras together. It's Tippy Tom! Oh no. The real Tippy Tom, not someone dressed as All Tippy right. Tom. Wow. There he is! Oh, Live in person! Oh. Tippy Tom! Get him away! Oh, yeah. Tippy Tom, our homeless oh, friend. Yeah. Sure that's not Jason? Tippy, Tippy Tom, Tom is uh, one of the fixtures in New York City. He's a homeless guy. 
Uh, <laughs> doesn't, beard, doesn't shower. His beard is looking what like is, an old cat. He's also terrible. Hey, what is he for Halloween? Hepatitis? He's <laughs> He's got the mange. Dude, I think he's been drinking. And lice. Yeah, he's been drinking on this Halloween. Hey, Tippy, Give Tippy Tom a mic. Let Tippy Tom... Well, don't Tom give it to him. Crowd. Hold it in front of his mouth. Right. And watch it melt. Let's see if Tippy Tom has some words for the crowd. All right, my name's Tippy Tom. And when I say, I love you. I love you. Let's kill Tom. Let's kill... All right, all right, all right. How about a song? Yeah, we should. Hey, Tippy, sing a little song, Tippy Tom. You got all karaoke. Right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Okay. Tippy, sing a song. Oh, no. Tippy Tom is so drunk. <laughs> I know. Go for it. Should hold him. Right. Kill him if we say so. Come on, guys. Tell him to kill Tom. How about a song, Tippy? A little song. Okay. Don't wait for him to be quiet. Just Ready? sing. Start spreading the news. It's all these motherfucking stuff going quarters. I'm leaving today. It's going quarters. I'm gonna be a part of it. New York, New York. Right. Anyone throws anything, they will be thrown out of the place. Right. Uh, we can see all shit. of you. It's all right, you want, <laughs> you, want, you, want, you, want not, you want another song? Tom, stop. And I'm just saying song. that because if you throw stuff at him, he throws feces back. That's right. It's like a monkey. That's Don't right. throw things. It's me. Yeah. Okay, wait a minute. What I'm going to say is this. Yeah. Anybody out there? Anybody out there want this? Colin, this is like a wonderful life to you, isn't it? If you want my body. <laughs> Come on, baby, let me know. All right, all right. Oh. Tippy Tom is All right, done. let's hear it for Tippy Tom. Good job. There you go. All right, Tom. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, I suggest now, when you get right back to wherever you're going, shower this immediately, so you great. all. Welcome oh. to uh, oh. Lice. Wow. Back to the D-train, you cocksucker. <laughs> oh, I see. Otto and George have made it to the table. Yeah, I see that, Anthony. <laughs> Very good. Hey, you want to do the first contest, the bobbing for marital aid? Bobbing for marital aid contest? Oh, we're gonna, oh, we need oh it takes a while to set up? Even for Paul R. Nelson security? I'm Paul R. Nelson, and I'm a douche. All right, we'll do a quick break. When we get back, we'll do bobbing for marital aids. Rock. They're bringing the table out. It's the Opie and Anthony Show. The ONA virus spreading across America. We're live at the Hard Rock Cafe. Yeah. What is it? By the way, the Opie and Anthony Halloween Show is brought to you by Saw 3. If it's Halloween, it must be Saw in theaters everywhere. Uh, we're pretty much set up for the bobbing for marital aids contest, Anthony. Bobbing for marital aids. Opie, we got to thank Robin <laughs> from MySexyStore.com for the marital aids. MySexyStore.com. Okay. Right. We, we got Danny on stage. We got, what, four contestants? That is correct. Uh, Danny, what's going to happen here? Well, uh, they all have some marital aids in bins. They have some crap in there that's really gross. Yeah, they're like big plastic bins, and they're full of water, full of and water. there's marital aids in there. But now, what's the twist here? There's no twist, really. It's just no. to see chicks bobbing Will and you having, uh, please, phallic yeah. things in their mouth. Please, uh, please, please refrain from, that? Yeah, I got from saying such words. All right, so, right. so we got, uh, yeah, we got uh, bins of water in front of all the girls, about four or five so inches of water. We got the marital aids in there, and we got other stuff, too. We got, like, uh, cow parts. Yeah, we have, there's uh, some cream corn, sauerkraut, well, and my favorite well, is uh, there's pieces of cow tongue. Pieces marital. of cow tongue. So, Where is it? Are they going to uh, Now, what's the, um, what's the object? Whoever can get all of them out first gets first prize. All the marital aids out? Get them out of the bin first gets first, and there will be a runner-up as well. Is Do I see a, an eyeball floating in one of those bins? I hope not. Ugh. Is he up? Ah. All right, I guess uh, is, it, uh, is the object, if they're stuck in the water for a long time, if they give information on Al-Qaeda, <laughs> does that matter for yeah. waterboarding? Oh, there's no such thing. Ah, ah. Water torture. All right, Why is there a guy? I don't know. There's like three hot chicks and a guy. Could you lift up your skirt from the back, please? Whoa, he's second. a hot... Thank you. Mom, I'm wow, wait. Wow, loser! Sexy nurse just uh, lifted up the Those back of clean. her dress. And wow. why, don't we, why don't we meet the contestants? All right, who do we got, Danny? What is your name, miss? Andrea. And Andrea's dressed very, very sexy. She's a naughty nurse, Andrea. Yeah. Sexy, yeah. naughty nurse. Naughty, naughty. And she's got her, her, uh, her blindfold on. Yes. Hey... Hey, fellas. Shut up. 
there showing them. What are you chanting for, you jackasses? Some Jesus, kind of... it's like they, they show them and then they chant. Well, sometimes the expectation is part of the erotic. Yeah, story. right. So what? What? And uh, what? What do you do, Miss? Uh, a little bit of everything. Yeah. A little bit of everything. That's always nice to hear. All right, move on to the next gal. What's Miss? your name, Missy? Martha, but the pets know me as Harry Potter girl. Yeah. Oh, she was the one we called Harry Potter. Last hey. year. Harry Potter with boobs. Yeah, Harry Potter with boobs. She's yeah. in the. Bobbing for marital aids. Yay. Yes, she'll be bobbing for marital aids. All right. And Very she, nice. she seems to, uh, you, you enjoy the drink, do you? Yes, yeah, she's That's hammered. Nice. All right. And now our only gentleman contestant. What's oh. your name, sir? Mystic from fullblownaids.com. Yay. Yes, of course I recognize you. What's his name? I can't hear a word you're saying over there. They're saying hello. They're saying, They're saying hello. Hello, hello. Uh, now, why why did you decide to enter this competition? Because uh, Travis handed me a form and I didn't know what I was signing up for. Oh, you could have backed like out. A, though, a lot of Marines get in that way, I hear. <laughs> yeah, you uh, you okay. Out. Well, good luck to you. Thanks, I, I guess. I hope you got a good mouth. It's pretty. Yeah. Um, Yay. Sure, <laughs> Anything you want to say there, sir? Uh, I want to plug the hideout on WTKS. All right. Way to use the time valuably. Yeah. Hey, can we just good. not kick him off? Get him off the stage. Get him off the stage. Wow, he's being removed. Feed him to Tippy Tommy. Kill yourself. Get him off the stage. Feed him to Tippy Tommy. Great. Way to take the hot out of it. There was yeah, right. something that really bothered me about that guy. Yeah. All right, the final contestant, Danny. The fact that he was a guy. Yeah, can we get exactly. a broad up here? We gotta get that fourth one. Yeah, yeah, can we get one more broad that wants in? Hey, come on. Yay. Bobby from Maryland. Who get wants us in? a broad. Yay. All right, they're grabbing another hot broad out of the audience here at the Hard Rock Cafe. Tippy Tommy, Tippy Tommy. We're we need, lifting her on Oh, get stage. Tippy Tom. That'll make it hot. How all come right. it? Yay. All the girls are blindfolded. Right. Uh, Fezzi, you're not a girl. They get off oh, the stage. Oh, wow. Yay. You want one more there, Fez? Fez, he wants in. Fez, you think you could uh, maybe excel at this competition? Yeah, I think I got this down. This is easy. Hey, this is us. Saturday night at my house. <laughs> yeah, I like how you use uh, that uh, that term, get it down. Hey, can we, you can we, get it down, I understand. Easy. Are those blindfolds effective? Or no? They're going to see. Hey, anyone without a gag reflex. Yeah. Well, I don't want to ruin your spit curl on your I hope that is spit. That made the curl on your head. Well, it's it's stiff and it's gonna be there tomorrow. So. <laughs> All right, very good. It's a, it's oh, a nice curl. Like her now. Clark Kent. Yeah, Fez, we're, yeah. we're buying it for that. Hey, uh, <laughs> let's meet the last two contestants, Danny. Who did we just drag up? Miss, what is your name? Karen. Yay! Yay! Patrice wants to see uh, your boobies. She's blindfolded, just trying to flash, trying to find Patrice. Perfect. That is something. She's trying to smell cocoa butter. <laughs> <laughs> Bob Kelly, everyone. And she is really enthusiastic about this. Yeah. All right, and finally, who's our last contestant? She's dressed like a devil angel. Loretta, girl fan, FBA. FBA, oh. yes. All right. OAExperience.com, right? OAExperience.com? Yeah, yeah, either sure. one. We'll hey, get we're, you there. We're all taking right. video, and uh, we're, we're getting pictures of this mess. Oh, it's going to end up. It's going to end up all over the place. Like so uh, if you're not here to see this, you go to places like YouTube or uh, a lot of the other websites, and you'll see pictures and videos. Hey, Colin, comment. Yeah, that last one is hot. She's dressed like the duality of man. <laughs> right. She's got uh, devil horns, yet she's wearing a halo. Mm. Yeah. Oh. Isn't that all of it us? It was a staring yeah. wheel. Get it? The contradiction of it all. I can't, I can't get past her bunt. What's that? What's that supposed to be? Oh, some kind Jesus. of sick joke? <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. All right, enough <laughs> of your chance. They're showing them. Just gonna ask back. All right, enough with that, please. Help us out. We're trying to get some of this on the radio. All right, now we have to. Uh, somebody obviously from the show has to look and see who removes all the marital leads first. Okay. Uh, make sure everyone starts at the same time. We don't want an advantage. Right. We don't want one person to have an advantage. All right, so what's in the bins again? We got the marital aids, we got the the cow tongues, we got cream corn. What else, Dan? Shake them up uh, a little. There's some sauerkraut in there. It's sauerkraut. Just, now, do they know how many marital aids so are in each bin, or are they just you know, just going to be searching around? Nice ass. Oh, okay, that's good. All right, and we get the, spinach. We get the best view because we're just staring at their ass. You get the best view. I got to look at the girl in the end. What's wrong with the girl <laughs> in the end? Besides everything. Besides. 
Is that her, is that her back? <laughs> now that is Bob, why are you being so hurtful? I don't really know yeah. where her ass Leave Bob begins. Leave Barbara Kelly alone. And Bob. her back ends. <laughs> it does. It looks like me and drag. <laughs> All right, here we go, guys. Like... Not three. Bobby for Barbara. Suck, suck, suck. Oh, there's a favorite in the crowd. One, two, three. Bob for Marilyn. Yeah. Come on, Fred Schlinstone, get one that. Pulled it right yeah. out, a big red one. Uh, yeah. Oh, my God, this girl in the end has got four. Wow. Why is she holding her hands? Oh, my God, she's got a big black Whoa. Marilyn. Aid. Yeah. <laughs> Patrice! Holy Jesus. Well, we got a size queen in the contest. There are more, you dummy. She dropped it back in the water. She's oh, my God, is that girl a moron? That girl a moron. <laughs> she pulled one out, thought she won, and then when uh, Danny told her there's more in there, she dropped it back in the water. This girl on the, this girl the, on the left, the girl in the naughty nurse outfit, is pulling them out like uh, a pro. She's a machine. She is like a chick at a frat house. Yeah. <laughs> oh, wow. my God, she knows exactly where they are. She's <laughs> flinging them around. She's needed a lot of rides home. And what a view we have. She's in that water like William Shatner's second wife. <laughs> she is pulling them out. Her every uh, The whole part of her body is in the water Bill, now. get in there and get a shot. What happened? Did you give up? Move right in and get you a only shot. Got, you only got one. You have to get all one of them. One more. One more. Yeah, she all had all of them. All of them. Look, look at this. Oh, my God. Look at it. Oh, my wow. God. The she's naughty nurse swimming. is swimming. She's, swimming. She's, she's in there like Tommy Lee's babysitting. <laughs> <laughs> We got a pro in the competition. Oh, wow. Oh, my goodness. Come on, get it. She went from nurse to Lacey Peterson. <laughs> <laughs> She's completely in the water. She's completely in the bin. Oh, my God. Look at the one on the end looking for plankton. She doesn't even know there's none left. She's just going. Yeah. She's straining the marital age through her uh, baleen in her mouth. That's a whale joke, people. On, they use it for krill. Oh. All right. Wow. Do we have a winner? Is there a winner yet? Almost. Did, did, no. almost. almost. I think the nurse Yay. is searching for one last one. One last one. She's searching through cow guts and everything else. She can't find it. The other, uh, the girl at the end, the devil angel, Daddy, is uh, yeah. pulling yeah. some out. She's got a few. She's looking for the cow guts. <laughs> oh no, Fatty might win the contest. Wow. Wait, don't hide your ass. Pull your hand. Yeah. Show your hidey. Come on, Fred Slingstone. Show me your ass. We got a winner. Wow, what an upset. What an upset. Devil Angel. Well, come. Opie, can you put it a different way? This is radio. I know it was a come from behind uh, victory, but I know uh, certain things don't make the air. Um, this, uh, the nurse was in the lead. She couldn't find that last one. All right, all right. All right. Shut up. Help us out a little bit. I am going to douse you. You want to be doused with cow guts? Yay! Uh, the, the nurse almost had it. You had one more left, and then Devil Angel Girl pulled it out at the end with a lot of gusto Danny, and a lot of mouth action. She's completely soaked. How do you feel? Photo op. What? You feel yeah, what? she's all wet. You went swimming. You went into the uh, bin I know, with I your entire to body. Fucking good. You're, a, you're a little gal, aren't you? And you fit in that bin. Why couldn't you find the last one? I don't know. It's, like, it's slippery. It's yeah, wow. slippery. They usually are, honey. Uh, you were pulling them out like a pro, though. I tried my best. Yeah, you did great. You don't you usually uh, use teeth, right? It's a lot easier with the fake ones. With the fake yeah. ones, you can use teeth. Well, obviously, that's <laughs> oh, a good, good job. strategy. Yeah, we like love that. her. <laughs> and uh, what an upset. Uh, let's talk to the victory, uh, the victor, victress. Uh, Whatever you want to call her. How did the, the water taste? She looks like she's used to having things in her mouth. How did and the we're not talking about marital aids. How did the water taste? Oh, disgusting. All right, good. Yeah, yeah and now uh, you were you were behind in the count, and then all of a sudden you just came to life, and I saw marital aids flying out of the bin. <laughs> what happened? What inspired you? I got a last bit of momentum. Just had to keep it going. Yeah. yeah. Had to win. What were you thinking of when you were uh, putting them in um, your mouth? What were you I pretending they were? Know. Yum, yum, yum. <laughs> I don't know, Bob. What do you think of? <laughs> he thinks. Thank you, Dane. Thank you, Dane. <laughs> well, what's your name? What's your name? Loretta. Greta. Loretta. Loretta. You guys, let's hear it for Loretta. Loretta she won the, the winner. Bobby Loretta. Loretta. She Yay. wins. Uh, what does she what win does here? She win? Let's go to the uh, prize list. She wins three hundred fifty dollars. Three hundred fifty bucks. Wow. Ooh. Ooh! I thought we were playing fatty pig fatty for a buck. <laughs> I'm teasing. <laughs> I'm teasing. You're beautiful. I know. And you should have said 50 nice. cents. 
Wow, that's really good. I'm teasing, of course. You're a yes, very lovely girl. Those teeth. Why did you hide your hiney? You have a lovely hiney. Oh. Wow. Let me see that. All right. right. She that's just, that, she just went bad. up a few points in the book. That's you got a nice good. bum there, honey. Nice. You're hiding that. You can take nice. that home with you, honey. Yeah, whatever. She wants to take some of the marinade home with her. Of course you can. Take the black one. You know you want it. <laughs> All the yeah. big... Why does it have to be bigger? I mean, just yeah, stop. But it doesn't work. Wait, wait. <laughs> can you lift up the front? Oh, you have nothing underneath? Oh, yeah. nice. that makes it even better. Oh, come on. Come on, yeah. let's see. I want to see if you take good care of yourself. Or if it looks like a convict after four days. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you're in between uh, grooming. Uh, all right. Is that it? It looks like a... a yeah. to, ladies like and gentlemen, first let us give a hand to all the beautiful ladies yeah. that participated in bobbing for marital aid, as well as the winner. Nice <laughs> rally. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Yeah, you can, take, uh, you can take those home with you, ladies. There you go. You can, hey, can give, you give them to your friends. I'll get, I'll get them. I'll do cleanup. Can Excuse you give that one back see. to Colin? Fez has just volunteered to clean up. Wow, he's gonna. Fez, you can't take those home with you. Yeah, Fez is. Jesus, uh, Fezzy. But Fez is collecting them all up. He's he's asking for the black one. All right, Fez is uh, hiding them under. Third grade joke. What? Well, all right, I didn't leave any for the other kids. <laughs> Reminds me of trick or treating at my uncle. <laughs> all right. Well, Coming you need the little whisker burn to go with those. Yeah. <laughs> Coming up, what's the next contest we're going to do here? As they clear the stage off. Oh, that looks disgusting. The candy eating uh, contest. Oh, boy, that looks hard to carry. It's like carrying a 10 gallon. Tank. I think you shouldn't dump that out yet. We may have used for the one of The suit of the day is New England clam chowder. <laughs> you dirty skanks. <laughs> Otto, you like that contest? That was pretty cool. Yeah, it was all right. Uh, do we have the uh, German Shepherd peanut butter contest coming wait, up, wait, or is that for no, later? No, 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 no. Go back. Go back. What's up? You're ruining everything. No, no, wait, just do it. Just, no, just. No, you got to bring it back the other way, there, Craig. Yeah, yeah. go the other way, cause we were. Uh, yeah. Oh, dude, no, no. Yay! Oh, watch your back. Oh no, no watch no, your back. No. Watch your back. They're, oh, well. they're trying to remove the bins this of water. This is hysterical. Wait, that's the water. Oh, way, dude. Oh, oh no, it's oh, it's sloshing. Dude, it's, it's the other sloshing. way. That's somebody from the no, stray cat out here. It's sloshing. Oh, they're throwing marital aids at each other. And cow tongues. Right. The cleanup crew. I think that one sprung a leak. Yeah. That one looks like the most difficult. It's most full. You'll be okay. And uh, Steve Buscemi is taking it out. <laughs> <laughs> also, someone said it looks like the guy from the Stray Cats as well. Yeah. yeah there good you go. Charlotte. Nice. Good Charlotte. Good Charlotte. This looks like Tom Hanks and Philadelphia. Wow, All right. We're going to. This crew is professional. We're going to take a break. When we get back, we'll do the candy eating contest on the uh, Opie and Anthony right. show. The ONA virus spreading across America. We want to thank uh, Major World, I think, for the prize money. Majorworld.com. Major World. Major World. I think I got the plug somewhere around here. I couldn't find it, fan. So, all right, we'll continue in just a bit. It's the ONA virus live at the Hard Rock Cafe. We'll be back with more of the 2006 Opie and Anthony Halloween show live from the Hard Rock Cafe in New York City. Jim Norton will be appearing on The Late Show with David Letterman tonight on CBS. Check local listings for showtime. Opie and Anthony. Opie and Anthony. We now return to the Opie and Anthony Halloween party from the Hard Rock Cafe in New York City. <laughs> Fat belly acre, shut up. Sponsored by Saw 3. Well, they're bringing a guitar on stage, Anthony. It's the Opie and Anthony Show live from the Hard Rock Cafe. It's our Halloween party. We got a special guest for everybody from the show Rockstar. Let's hear it for Ryan Starr, everyone. Ryan Starr is here to perform a song. Later on, by the way, we got, we got Flavor Flav. I went backstage and saw Flav. He is here. He's in the house. He's going to perform some new stuff a little later on, but... We have Ryan Starr. Ryan, the stage is yours. What's going on, man? Let's do it. It's the perfect time of night to be losing your clothes now. If you carefully take them off, then I'll carefully show you how. In a minute, we'll be gone. So we might as well just fuck 
Cause the church is their old field Empty prayers are out of love Oh, oh, you're not yourself You're not yourself tonight Oh, oh, you got your life Now get yourself in mind the perfect child of night to be losing your mind now as the curtains finally fall will you kindly take your bow so low now time down waste your life it's the perfect child of night to be losing your clothes yeah back of your car let's find out who you really are i'll never change if you want me to you better change if i ask you so tell me what is the matter with this they say it starts with just one kiss we're never gonna be here again Ask me what you want me to God money nail me up against the wall God money don't want everything I want it all No you can't take it No you can't take it No you can't take that away from me No you can't take it No you can't take it No you can't take that away from me Head like a hole, black as your soul. I'd rather die than keep you control. Head like a hole, black as your soul. I'd rather die than keep you control. God, money's not looking for the cure. God, money's not concerned about the sick among the pure. God money lets go dancing on the backs of the bruise. God money's not one to choose. No, you can't take it. No, you can't take it. No, you can't take that away from me. No, you can't take it. No, you can't take it. No, you can't take that away. Black as your soul, come on. I'd rather die than give you control. Come on, head like a hole. Black as your soul, yeah. I'd rather die than give you control.
throws the guitar. Ryan Starr, everyone. That rock, huh? That... Wow. Good Not job, bad. Man. Kill. Nice set of pipes. Oh, wow. <laughs> I guess he had a problem with someone in the crowd because there was a little uh, back and forth going. The rest of them liked it. <laughs> yeah. Oh, the no. big guy is pissed now that he got doused with water. He got doused with water. He got doused. Ryan Stark came back on stage with a bottle of water and threw it at that guy over there in the front row. So that was an amazing performance. Very cool, man. I Damn like it. the Ryan Stark. He's all and right. His yeah. girlfriend was so. His girlfriend was singing every word along with the song. That never happens with comics. No. They never stand on the side of the stage and no. go, "I'm dodging you." <laughs> <laughs> he killed. He really did kill. Uh, we're gonna get Flavor Flav on stage. In a few minutes here, Anthony. We got a huge, huge entourage from Flavor Flav. Well, yeah. There's like 40 or 50 guys with them backstage. Get at it, really? And they all have ankle bracelets. And <laughs> That's what you just heard on Mike, the feedback. <laughs> <laughs> I think it would be smart to get them on early as well. You, oh, is that what you're getting at? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Might be. It, it could get ugly, I'm thinking. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, oh Jesus, no. <laughs> what? What? Oh, yeah, I think I see your point. Well, you know. What do you guys want to do next? Are we ready for Flavor Flav? Uh, he's chilling right now. He's chilling? All right, yeah. I just got the word that Flavor Flav is chilling. So we can chilling. go on to the next contest, and we can... Oh, please. Let's do the, uh, the uh, what, the glue traps. Are we ready for the glue traps? Where is Patty? Yeah, where is Stalker Patty? Is she in the house? Yes, Patty has not missed an event. Oh, that we have Patty, done where are you? Since right, let's get day one. Patty so. on stage as, Patty. They, as they set the stage for the next contest. Where is Twitchell's? We don't know where Twitchell's is. All right, the, the next contest, let me see this. We're going to be doing the uh, the mouse blue trap. Mouse oh. blue trap. I didn't even know. Oh, there she is. Wait, wait. Get oh, my God. Yeah. Oh, Patty's on stage. Patty, something's going on with your belly. you got to get that checked. What's going on? Why, you look like a Biafran. I know. You look like Madonna should be adopting you. <laughs> I think she's trying What's to... What's going on? I think she's trying to be a pregnant... Oh, you're pre it's your costume. Your costume oh, because is you're, that you're pregnant? Because you're, you're a virgin. No, we, uh, we can't hear you. I, I, we, <laughs> oh, she's the immaculate conception. God would never do that to anybody. He's God. Why would he do you? Yeah, Here, Patty, come here. You know what God could get? <laughs> He's God. All right. Give her the mic. All right. What are you again? Okay. Speak up into the goddamn microphone. <laughs> you with that little voice. She's, in... She's pregnant with the Immaculate Conception. Yeah, this one's on. Yeah. Here, Patty. Yeah, go going at the Immaculate Conception. The Immaculate Conception. I actually thought it was her gut. Hi, Patty. I think it's a good move. All right, Patty, on yeah. stage, what are you? The Immaculate Conception. Ah. Oh, listen to that voice. Jesus. You're a bloated scoliosis victim. Wait, so... Oh, Patty, that... I don't think that mic could be there like that. It's feeding back off your chiclet teeth. All right, well, Patty is uh, the Immaculate... Yeah. Before God had sex with you, wouldn't he give you some hair conditioner? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> What's under there that you used to, to make the pregnant look? Because you didn't make it very pregnant. If you're going to make it pregnant, it's got to be big. You're like I'm three like months. five months along. You could still kick you in the stomach and not be committing a crime. <laughs> wait, what do you use as... Wait, what's under there? <laughs> Couldn't you get a pillow or something? What the hell did you use? Oh, she had to hold it what up is there? that? Is that what you use late at night? Uh, my vagina. It's a dirty T-shirt. Oh, I'll be touching it. Correct me if I'm wrong, but Patty's going brawless right now. Nah, Patty's got no costume. Yeah. I just threw Patty's costume. I needed costume. that. No takers. I needed that shirt for Starbucks. Patty's oh. vagina Patty. smells like vomit. All right, put the fucking sign down. Patty's tumbleweed now. All right, they threw her costume back on stage. This is going nowhere. So let's hear it for Stalker Patty. Yeah, Patty. Yeah. <laughs> this is going nowhere. Hit the Absolutely road. Absolutely going nowhere. All right, are we ready for the glue traps? <laughs> oh, yeah. All right, they're setting up for the glue trap the competition, contestants Anthony. must come up. I don't even really know how this works, to tell you the truth. Yay. It's some kind of... They tried to make glue traps uh, <laughs> into a Halloween motif by using the mummy thing. 
Yes. So glue trap mummy. Yeah, we you know milk everything possible. You know, yeah. As much as so how does it work? Like what's the object? First, can I try, uh, let's get the contestants coming up to the stage. Oh please. All right. The, the glue trap contestants could Drew, Robert, Mark, and Timothy. Please come up to the stage. Uh, I guess go over to where Kenny is. And yes. You um, can't miss Kenny. He's the big idiot. Look at that. It's the early Robert Kelly. Wow, that is. This guy's dressed as Dice Gay, Anthony. Look at that. There you yeah, go. I see. Nice. Hey, you're Gay. ripping me off, Jack <laughs> Look at this guy's costume. Wow. You really what, just what are you, a subtle sir? look. Dan, let's uh, interview these guys. Sure. What's your name? Rob. And what are you dressed as for, for the uh, the audience at home, obviously? We all see it, but explain your costume. A flasher. Oh, he's a flasher. Yes. And he, a very uh, healthy flasher. If you were that healthy, you wouldn't have to be a flasher. No, you'd be in a porno movie. <laughs> Bob Crane. And with Bob Crane, hit him over the head with a tripod. <laughs> you got someone dressed as your mom's box. Uh, very your nice. mom's box. What? It, all it says, he's wearing a box, yeah. and all it says on it is your mom's. Right. So you can assume what that means. Uh, and now, sir, you, uh, Dice Gay, do you do any impression of Dice uh, Gay? Nah, not really. Nah, you just wear the clothes. Yeah. That's good. You got the rainbow belt on and everything. You really went all out. That's good. It looks good. And you got the authentic Dice gut that he has now, too. And uh, do you have a complete lack of any talent? Because that would be just exactly like Dice. Nah, I'm fucking useless. All right. All right. Yeah. Well, that was wonderful. <laughs> not, we also have Elmo on stage. Now, I'm thinking the Elmo guy is just some guy that goes out on the streets in Times just Square. Like that. And, uh, and, like, takes pictures for money. Oh, no, it's you. Sergeant Magoo. You didn't ban me, though. Thank you. Sergeant Magoo is Elmo, yes. How y'all doing? Uh, Great wonderful. party. That's yeah. a rental. Great party. As you have Great a guy in a pig mask. Can't say fuck America. <laughs> that looks like Patrice's rug. <laughs> All right, that's uh, that's it for the contestants for the uh, the glue trap mummy competition. So how is this going to work again then? Well, of course we make it gay because they have to disrobe. Oh, uh, do they? Yeah. By uh, to what point? Uh, I'd say underpants. Skivvies. Uh, uh, yeah. Down to your underpants. Oh no, guys. he doesn't. He says he doesn't have underpants on. He doesn't have underpants on. Uh, we didn't foresee this. No. Well, uh, does uh, is uh, anyone have uh, extra underpants? Can he fashion that T-shirt into a loincloth? Uh, well, he said he'll use his hairy uh, belly. Is that good for the contest? Well, he's gonna have to. All right, you're gonna have to use yeah. your hairy belly. All right, uh, the rest of the guys have to get down. All right, ladies. They are disrobing in front of the All right. crowd here. Oh, the the Elmo Cafe. guy's trying to be sexy. Right. And uh, uh, the, the, your mom's uh, box right, well. is uh, slapping his butt in his boxer brief. Oh, jeez. No, oh, geez. he said up to the skivvies. You keep those on, please. Yeah. yeah it, we, uh, Girls are pointing in horror. This is uh, uh, horrific, Anthony. This, is, has, this who, has turned real gay. Uh, by the way, this Sam, no homo. who thought this up? Yeah, who uh, thought this? <laughs> <laughs> you don't know? Not me. Yeah, no one's going to take Sam. credit for this. Huh? No yeah. one's taking credit for anything that involves guys getting undressed. I don't want any more undressed. show business perks. Okay, let me maybe oh, I Danny. explain the premise because I'm not sure your mom's box guy is getting it. Okay, yeah. Uh, it's We tried to tie in mummies, which is a Halloween staple. Of course. With the glue traps. Glue uh, traps there being the is. wrapping, being the wrapping of the mummy. Yes. Is that it? Oh, wow, I didn't know uh, Elmo was a Marine over there. Hoorah! Hoorah! It's the Marine Semper Fi. Uh, yes, Carl. The Marine Semper next to the, he looks like he's next to one of the American Taliban. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's a very good visual, and, and that's a very good laugh for the, the guy, crowd here. The guy in the end looks like a, a rock and stock and robot with leukemia. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> All right. All right, then. So, and then the, uh, they're going to have a set amount of time to put as many mouse traps on their person as possible. All right. And what? then, uh, if there aren't, if they aren't all on, we they will we'll make sure they're on. And then we will uh, first person to take them all off wins. All right. So it's kind of a, it's a get them all on, get them all off. Exactly. Kind of thing. All right. Wow. Here we go. It's 
Give everybody their mouse traps. Yeah, everyone gets the uh, glue mouse traps. Here they are. The glue oh my, trap these things, contest. These things are really notorious, too. Yeah, these they, things will take skin off, Colin. Very sticky. Usually you see oh, little yeah. mice suffocated, nose first in them. By the I way, don't need any, thank you. The winner's going to get $350. Are there warnings on there not to touch them to your skin and stuff? What's the matter, boss? Boss. You pussy. Boss. You got boss. all scared of one. Boss acted like he was holding up an electric charge. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Wow, you are really hairy, dude. That could be a problem. Uh, Majorworld.com. Thank you for the money for this uh, contest. Majorworld.com. All right, are we ready? How long do they have to get the glue traps on their body? Like 90 seconds? Is that about right? Two minutes, okay. Yeah, they got a couple of minutes. All right, wow. The Marines getting started right away wait, with the wait, lower wait, section of the begun. body. They have begun. Start. Wait, wait, wait. No, they're just slapping them on. Here they go. Shouldn't somebody wait put them on for there? it. All right, here we go. They've already started, Anthony. Make sure we're going to be looking. If we deem you're not really applying them with enough gusto, yeah. we're going to, uh, there you go. Slap those things on good. Make sure they're tight oh and on God. there. This, this is hairy right. guy. Is really gonna have a problem. This is not the right. Marine is putting him around his uh, stomach. Yeah, yeah. Putting it like body armor. He's used to that. Uh, hairy guy. Ha, ha, hey, hairy guy. You put him on your chest yet? Oh, There's God, one. Oh, right, hurt. right on the biggest, hairiest okay. part. Evolution from the second left on the poster guy. Uh, your mom's wow sticker. Uh, where are you putting him? Turn around. Let me see. Okay. You Jack gotta get Black, a little up yeah. by the uh, hairy chest over there. Yeah. yeah that's gonna He's hurt. Got He's working nipples. his way up. He doesn't care. He's working. Right. His nipples are pierced. He doesn't care. He's really doesn't Jerry care about Garcia, pain. Garcia, Jack Black looking motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, Thin, how, how about this? Make sure they have a, a dozen traps on them each, and then the first person rip them off. All right. All you have to do is have a thousand, a thousand, uh, uh, 12 traps on your body. Under, right. the, under the armpits. There right. they go. I guess he's doing good. How many guys? Well, this guy's going slow right, over he's here. He's got 13. Guys, all you need is 12 of these blue traps on your body. The Marine's got a baker's dozen on him all over the front of his body and the <laughs> sides. Uh, a couple of guys uh, opting to put some on the hair patch over their uh, lo uh, their lower back. Yeah. Right over the crack area. How about Andre Agassi? I know. And then uh, this guy here, uh, uh, your mom's uh, box, he's putting them on his legs, right. which are very hairy. All right. What's going on? What's going on? What is Marine? What are we missing? Oh, he, he put him under his arms. Man. That, oh, man. wow, the, the Marine put two under Marine? his arms. you got to explain. Yeah. These blue traps will take skin off their body. Yeah, they're very, very all right. sticky. Wait, wait. Hold on. Do all the contestants have uh, the blue traps on? These you guys are too easily dominated. Uh, the hairy guy right now is letting the audience put some on him. Right. Uh, Rich, so they're really putting them on tight. You know what? We need Rich Boss out there. Make sure the glue traps are on good. Yes. We yeah, don't want uh, anyone cheating. They gotta be. A close eye. Uh, sir, sir, you're putting them on your legs. I see they're straight. It should like be wrapped around your leg. Yeah. Wait, dude. You only need twelve. You only need twelve. Suck on those disgusting nipples. All right, these guys hey, are so drunk it is impossible. Look at boss. To organize boss, this at this Leave sucks. Mick. <laughs> leave Mick Foley alone. <laughs> Mick Foley. All right. All right. Voss is slapping. Oh, Voss just got it on his fingers. Flavor Flav! <laughs> just walked on stage in the middle of the, the glue trap yeah, contest. Flav. Flavor Flav. Hi. Flavor Flav on the stage, Anthony. Oh, the Flav. Flav. All right, Flavor Flav got bored backstage, which is fine. Yeah, the crowd chanting for Flav. Yeah. The guy's covered in glue traps. Yeah. Flav greeting the crowd. There's a trademark clock around his neck. He's wearing a big crown. Don't put out. He's like, don't put nothing don't on me. Nothing on me. Leave Flav will pull man. out a gat. He grew up with those traps. He'll shoot those traps off you. <laughs> All right, his, uh, his people are getting nervous after yeah. this thing. His peeps. Oh, yeah. Wow. So we got That's all right. One, two, one, two. Yo, New York! Thanks, Flav. Thanks, Flav. Hey, yo, check one, two. 
That's what I want y'all to do, all right? I want y'all to repeat after me. I want everybody to repeat after me, all right? Everybody say, oh! Say, oh! each and every one of y'all for all of the years that y'all supported me and my partner Chuck D for Public Enemy without y'all it would be no us. Second of all, one time for your man, let me hear you say it, Flavor Flay! Hey yo, from the bottom of my heart, I just want to thank each and every one of y'all that watched your man on TV. Y'all gave me the highest rated show ever in the history of VH1. 7.5 million, baby. Yeah, boy. Yo, check this out. Check this out. I just now came off of a nine different country tour with Public Enemy right now. Me and my partner Chuck D, we just got back. So I didn't get a chance to see Delicious yet. Oh, but believe me, it's getting ready to go down. Hey, yo, can I ask y'all a question, though? Is your man flavor flay pimping or what? Nah, but for real, y'all. Thank y'all for making me number one in the history of VH1. Also, to let y'all know my reunion. To let y'all know my reunion finale. Y'all got like 34.4 million, all that, you know. I ain't mad. Hey, yo, check this out. We're going to get back to some music, right? I want to come down here and party with y'all. Let me get off the stage. Come down here with y'all. Oh, yo, I forgot, I forgot, I forgot. Thank you, y'all. Yo, I love y'all, man. Up here on the panel. What's up? The panel. I call this the panel. Hey, yo, check this out, y'all. I just want to say, too, for the first time ever in my life. You've been in front of this many white people. Wrong. <laughs> hey, yo, can I tell you something? Hey, yo, can I tell y'all something? <laughs> He's wrong, because I've been in front of Morwood when I was on tour with you, too. Y'all need to know that. <laughs> but I love you anyway, though. I'm out of song, Blake. Hey, yo, but check this out. Today, for the first time in my life, I just want to feel proud to say I finally, finally released my solo album. <laughs> so, yo, I'm going to be back a little later. I'm going to be back a little later, you know what I'm saying, and give y'all a little history, which ain't no mystery. You know what I'm saying, New York? But yo, New York, what I want y'all to do, yo, check this out. Before I leave this stage, right, this is what I want y'all to do. When I put my hands up in the air, right, for one minute, 
I want y'all to make this the noisiest minute you ever had in your life. I want y'all to make as much noise as you can, as loud as you can, for as long as you can, for one minute. Let everybody know that New York is on the motherfucking map. Go! That's why I love being home, yo, for real. Hey, yo, check this out. I'll be back, man, you know what I'm saying, with a couple of my joints from my album, you know what I'm saying, the whole nine. Right now, I'm coming down here so I can party with y'all, get something to eat, get my drink on, hug up some of these fine ladies up in here. Yes, yeah, like that. One more time, y'all. Flavor, flag. Rock the house, y'all. Flavor Flav. He's coming back to do uh, a song, right? Yeah. In a little while, he'll be back on stage doing a song. Thanks, Flav. We greatly appreciate it. All right, where were we? We were in the middle oh. of the, uh, the Clue Trap Mummy contest. We got these guys on stage. They're pretty much naked, except for their underpants. They got Clue Traps all over them. And now the Glue Trap's no, been sitting for a little while. Yeah. Ah, uh, wow. <laughs> now might be a good time for you to tell people that Clue is no laughing matter. <laughs> and a lot of people have been injured by it. Right, here we go. Yeah, All they right. are hanging on these guys now. They've been sitting there. A couple of them still putting more glue traps on themselves. They, yeah. We only asked for a dozen, it's, and they keep putting glue on By the way, stuff. Bob just shook Flav's hand in a cool shake, and Bob went, great show, baby. Really? He was, show, hoping, baby. Would, he was hoping Flav would say you too. Nothing. All right. How are we going to do this, Stan? Well, they all have differing amounts at this point. It should just be first person to get all their traps off. Yeah, it's going to be first person to get all the traps off. All right. If you, you punish yourself by putting on too many traps, oh well. All right, Voss is yeah. making sure the traps are on good. Way to touch them, Rich. Nice and tight. These guys are so wasted, man. Get them on. They're so wasted. They have no idea the pain they're going to feel in a minute or two here. And we're really going to have to look and see who gets them off first, because I think we might have a close, uh, close yeah. race. Boss, don't forget Bosnian war criminal in front. All right, here we go. Here we go. Let's line up the contestants and uh, get this over with. The uh, glue trap mummy contest on the Opie and Anthony show. They're all mummified in their glue traps. All right, guys, uh, get back in position. All right, hold on. Wow, this guy put a glue trap on his beard. You're nuts. Oh, God damn. Uh, this is going to be a photo op, I'm telling you right now. Get your video cameras out. All right, are we ready? Here's the deal. The first person to get all their traps off. Yeah, and maybe do a little spin to show everybody that they're clean. a boy, Stan. All right, are you guys ready for this or what, huh? All right, we got the four contestants. Face the crowd. Here we go on three. Face the crowd. One. This guy's hammered. He doesn't even know where he is. No, wait, sir. He's just spinning yeah, yeah, yeah. around like Wait, a... idiot. Wait, no. Bob, wait, what Bob Kelly wants to look like? Wait. <laughs> All right, here we go on three. No, turn around. Turn around. The crowd's got to see this. All right. Oh, my God. On three. One, two, three. Start ripping go, the go. glue traps off. Oh, my God. Oh, oh that's bad. Right. Oh, the harm. Oh, the, the Marine's really doing a good job. The Marine is uh, feeling no pain, Anthony. The Marine is uh, going to win this, guys, unless you guys start it. Step it up. Step it up. Step rip it up. Rip it up. Rip it up. Oh, he's trying to rip it up. Marine's got hair. some on his back. Dude, he just took ah, it's in his hair. hair. It's in his hair. It's in his hair. Wow. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. They're ripping. Wow, he just ripped some skin off. Oh, hold on. on, hold on. It's on your hand. It's on your hand. It's on your head. You got to get him off. Mick Foley won. Yes. Oh, wait. Wow. I oh, go. you got one on your we hand. We have a tie. No. Oh, oh damn. Wah, wah, wah. Dude, he just edged you out. The guy with the beard has won. Man the blue trap on me contest. Man wow. Man did it. We gotta give it to him. He had he got him off first. Uh, uh, 
let me explain USA! something. USA! USA! Let me, <laughs> let me explain something, um, sir, Mr. Mr. Marine Corps. Yeah. Since you put more on you, that's your fault. <laughs> USA! I, I understand. I like how you could take the pain. But uh, he uh, he had one stuck in his beard and his hair, and he was able to rip it out. Yeah, that was very impressive. I know you had some on your armpits. All right, uh, the guy in the beard. What's your name again? Huh? D. D. By the way, congratulations! You won the contest. There, you get three hundred and fifty dollars thanks to MajorWorld.com. By the way, Uncle Fester is still trying his best yeah. to get uh, the glue traps off. He's gonna wake up tomorrow with one on his helmet. <laughs> <laughs> Anyone lose any skin? I don't know. He lost yeah, a little skin over there. There's a lot of rashing and uh, redness. Yeah. One wow, yeah, that guy's back. Where? Which guy? Right there on his back. Yeah. That, Look, at there's an imprint of a, a trap on this guy's back. Oh, ah, they're oh they're helping now. And he put oh. it on his chest. Oh, oh. God damn. Ah, oh, you just, you just blasted <laughs> that one harder on his back, dude. There you go. He went to pat him on the back, like, good job, and he just hit the trap. All right, let's hear it for all the contestants in the glue the trap mommy glue contest. Trap, mommy contest. Boo! That was pretty impressive. I'm there you scared. go. scared. Wow. It's that the Open at the show live from the Hard Rock Cafe. It's our Halloween party. The ONA virus spreading across America. Getting too old for this shit. They don't, they don't even know they're turning off the lights hey, in the green room. Hey, hey. We're in the pitch dark, and, and no one noticed that the, they turned the lights off. This is amazing. This is amazing. I'm too old for this shit. This has sucked every bit of life out of me. Oh, my God. I'm exhausted. Well, we weren't supposed to broadcast and, and do a live show ever again. We said that every year. We go, we're never doing that. Yeah. And then every year, hey, broadcast and live show. Right. Let's be stupid. Right. Oh, my God. Now we're in a green room. Half the people are, like, passed out. They're leaning against the light switches. And it's pitch dark, and no one notices that we're broadcasting in the dark. They I thought finally I had a turned tumor. the lights back on. I thought what? I had a tumor, because it slowly <laughs> started getting dark, and I'm like, ah, tumor, tumor. <laughs> and then I realized, no, it's a drunk against the dimmer switch. Yeah. All right. Are we uh, are we live? Can we can we just do this? I just want to know who took this mic, yeah, and stuck it up their ass. Check check. Yo yo, what's the deal? This is the butcher Ed Brock, the white rapping intern. Some of you motherfuckers may have heard of me. The boys are coming back up soon. We got a candy eating contest coming up next. Well, this is and Flame of Flame, as you all know, is in the house. Flavor Flame! Ladies, Whip Em Out Wednesday's coming up. Show your yes, boobies. Thank you. It's so fun. It's okay, don't. All Flavor's people have to do is chase them like 30 yards, and all of them will have a heart attack. <laughs> really? They're all fat. <laughs> all right. There's like one black guy in the audience going, what do I feel like? Hold on. Hold, save all this for the radio. I don't even know if we're, we're taping. Everything is being recorded. All right, well, can they turn down that the audience mic so if they start cursing again we can release like, it it's on the radio this is like KGB if, someone, if someone's listening just turn off the, the crowd mic oh my time. god I give up I, I, I give up you know what when you I give, give up, up Opie you go over there and I think those are shots of Jägermeister that we were supposed to take alright there you go finally it's, it only took a half hour we went thank on the you stage. are we ready we could do this now holy shit Someone, Steve? <laughs> This is going to be on the director's cut, a lot of this no, stuff. Oh, it's going to be Halloween Party 2006 director's cut. Oh, you know Elo. Edition. Elo, Elo is going to throw all this shit right on the channel. He doesn't give a crap. He ought to be one of your people. All right. <laughs> Believe me, Voss. He knows how to squeeze a penny. Right, the making me, of a hack. Let me make uh, <laughs> The making of a hack. All right, hold on, hold on. Save all this stuff. Let me make it official so they know, right, so they know where to start the edit when they have to put this whole mess together later tonight. I like how I'm being made to be professional and then, like, shut up! I'm losing my mind! Will you shut up, please? It goes from pro to yeah, boy, for half hour all of a sudden. <laughs> yeah, what happened? Yeah, dude, I, now I got to be reined in. It's recess for me, but uh, yeah, shut boy, for 10 Shut up! Give him the entrance. Shut give, up! Give him the entrance line up. All right, it's the Opie and Anthony. <laughs> <laughs> Who? I'm done. It's the Opie and Anthony show. We have uh, retreated to the green room, Anthony. Well, we were pushed back, yeah. Yeah, we were pushed back. 
I don't know what the hell just happened for the last 20, 30 minutes. I don't know what made the radio. Well, I have no idea at this point. I know we were doing a a, uh, a glue trap uh, mummy thing. Yeah. Uh, then all of a sudden Flavor Flav came out with an entourage that was really freaking scary. Well, come I on. thought all hell was going to break loose here at the Hard Rock Cafe, but it worked out in the end. Flav had the crowd, man. He yeah. sure did. Well, he's they a hype dig man. Him. Yeah. He, he knows how to get a crowd he knows going. How is it to say, oh. What, is that bad to oh. say he's a hype man? Did I say something you wrong? You didn't Patrice? say anything wrong. You know, I Rich just Voss, heard that in so many years. Uh, Rich Voss came up to me and just said the, the worst, most racist thing when what? Flav was up there. Because Flav was going, hey, oh, now, now give me a hey, say oh. And what did you say? I told he knows how to spell. <laughs> I told he knows how to spell. <laughs> hey, you know, hey hold racist. on, hold on. Brave man. Why, no. This dressing no, room no, is right just, across uh, the yeah. hall. I'm saying Why don't you knock on that door? Oh, yeah. Well, here's your kill. No, 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 I'm not doing that. No, no, yeah, all right, let's go. Don't so kill me. I got all ready. Let's go. 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 let us go Let's Let's go. Go. No, no, you're right. Come on, let's go. Is, Bring Flame in no, here. No, no, Patrice, one of these days, you're just going to have to punch a white guy in the face in front of all of us. Leave him alone. You're just going to have to do it. He just, just to prove a point. Simply that sometimes when Flame was out there, it looked a little bit like the opening scene in Last King of Scotland. <laughs> <laughs> no. no one's seen see that movie, think? but I want to see it, though. I'm, now I, I got to see it. It wasn't bad. It's getting great reviews. I got to give it to Colin. It's a. Uh, it's a new enough reference that it deserved yeah. more than it got in this well, one. No wait, <laughs> wait, can we get uh, Jimmy up to speed here? Thanks. Rich, why don't you say what you, you said a few minutes ago? Because Jimmy just walked back in. I was outside. I didn't even know. No, was uh, really, when Flavor Flav was doing his thing with the O's and the uh, a room of white guys and Patrice. Hey, oh, I guess he knows how to spell. Right? Oh, you're... Yeah, what are you trying to say? Damn, you just lost every bit of wow, confidence you've ever had in your life. Wow, no confidence left. Did you... Yes, Opie, you just took Opie the was complete heart out of him. Go knock what? On the door. You took the heart completely out of him. You, you no, no. Yeah, because yeah, he's shaking now because he knows I'll go and do it. You're right, you Wait, I want to play this movie. If it was just Flavor, it might be good. Yeah, but he's with four guys that want to fight somebody. Opie broke Voss. Opie was like that guy in Temple of Doom. He just reached in and grabbed Voss's heart out. He watched it pumping. It was over. Hold on, hold on, it's too good because Jimmy's got a share in this uh, in this laugh. So Voss was all cocky back here <laughs> in the safety of our green room and making flavor flav jokes, saying that he was only doing Save oohs and ahs because that's because that's all he knows how to spell. Right. <laughs> so I go, well, brave man, why don't we go across the hall and, and, stood and, up. and, and say that to Flav? He's right there across he's the hall. But Opie stood, stood up and started but walking. Norton, he walking. Didn't, Norton, he's not putting you up to speed on one thing. What? There's. 85 mass murders with Yeah. With yeah. yeah. I, I, I can't even... He was scared. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Because All I jokes. might have to prove I can throw a punch. <laughs> the two guys... And, and I would never say... The two oh, guys... No, and they would beat you the hardest for being with us. For, be, for being the yeah. Uncle Tom that's hanging out with you. I saw two of the guys at Machete Trevor Burbick in there. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, stupid yeah, me. He's out. I thought I was hanging with a real black guy for the last six years. I just realized you're not that black. Hey, hey, Look, I'm, I'm, I'm sitting there. Come on, let's have a walk over there. Yeah, I'll tell Patrice, him, I'll tell Patrice him what will talk. Say. No, no, sit down. Patrice will <laughs> sit down, and all of a sudden, he will fit in. I'm sick and tired. Perfect. So I'm going to tell him my voice. And I'll we'll just be like, what's up, man? Voice. And we'll be aliens that just landed on a planet. And this is what I would do if I sat down. Go walk in. What'd you say, dude, in that wizard's costume? What are you, grand wizard or something? Yo, Flav, nigga's a grand wizard up in here. And, and a big hand will come over and just smack this stupid pointy hat I off would, my head. Only th I would not want to see. If it was just him and another, I, I, that'd be. I, there's a, at least five dudes. I'm watching them because that's what oh, I'm yeah. You're just watching. Uh, those guys this are one, everybody. This yeah. one. Trouble. This I'm one's trouble. Right now. I would, if I was a cop, I'd say, you got to go. What, nigga? Yes. What, you racist? Yes. You have to leave, sir. <laughs> yes. You, you're up to no good. You beat somebody up just before you got here. Out you go. <laughs> I got to tell you, we got a very cocky crowd. The Opie and Anthony audience is very cocky. Yes. They were playing along because they were scared Sless. They were scared oh, yeah. His whole crew was out there. I disagree. How many stories do you Let me tell you something. How many stories First of all, 
I'll go next, right next door and I'll identify you and he'll kick your ass. Right. I'll say, it's the guy that looks like he's in the second row at a Loverboy concert in 88. <laughs> <laughs> First of all, nothing. That was pretty good. Ah, that was pretty good. Was good. How many stories do you hear where, like, one of the None. entourage shoots somebody? Or, you know, it's just not But it's you. Play. Nobody wants to even make the paper. What's that? <laughs> yeah. But you won't make the paper. When did you get here? Oh, <laughs> uh, oh. Uh, hey, he's had some great lines. He I certainly know. has. Come on, well, some real singers. <laughs> He's the only wants a piece of boss on the He's Opie. He's He's Opie. 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 And I'm the guy that can, he's going to take and get beat up? No. What? No. It's what? good radio. No. Stop making okay. proclamations. <laughs> hear him? He sounds like Flav now. He's like, he's like yo, get. Yeah. yeah. I think Ope is completely right, though. When, when he went out to the crowd, the crowd, they would have booed anybody. Mm. They were booing everybody. And there were people, you suck, you suck, whatever chant, you know, because they just feel like doing it. Not a peep for Flav. Well, Nothing but adulation. Don't Doesn't get him going. Doesn't matter. Nah, he's Doesn't nice matter if oh, Whitey so. went out there, no matter who it was. <laughs> Jesus Christ could be out there curing people. And they'd be, you, you suck, you suck. Why you gotta be why? There was a fear yeah. in that audience. There was a fear in that audience. Yeah, there's one sitting right any other you think base? so? Yeah. I don't think so. I any, disagree. Any, uh, any other totally. observations? How many people did he go out with? Dude, there were, I don't know, man. He brought them all out. They were strategically our, placed. The, girl, the girls <laughs> they were actually I'll tell were you what. Strate- they like, didn't they 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 throw them. Like they more didn't of throw a quarter. Huh? <laughs> they didn't throw no quarters. They didn't yell <laughs> nigga chew. Nothing. No, they nothing. went, everybody say ho. That 80s ho. Right. Oh. And they all went ho. Your dumb fans start hey. going, the roof is on fire. No. <laughs> we don't need no water. Don't let shoot. it burn, am I effa? Any other yeah. observations as we're back here? They really yeah. did wave their hands in the air like they just didn't care. <laughs> they yeah. just didn't care. <laughs> they all said, ho. Oh. Oh. All right, what do you guys think of this mess so far? I, okay, okay, exactly. exactly. Well, it's a tough edit. Tough I'm, edit. I'm Perfect going to a center. <laughs> Wait, everyone's talking, hold on, hold on. Everyone's talking at the same time. I yeah. thought Colin had the funniest line outside when we were talking. He said he said the King of Scotland line, and I heard it. And then when he started going, hey, ho, hey, Colin said that was Edie Amin's campaign speech. <laughs> <laughs> Damn right. Go, hold on. Yeah. yeah. yeah he had a look. He wanted to make sure Damn I wasn't right. in trouble. Yeah, what's up? Yeah, that was very oh. funny. Right across the hall. Up? Colin, he wouldn't hit you. You're wearing his outfit. <laughs> <laughs> I like to see Colin use his remote control crane to stop that yeah. beating he would get if he was <laughs> Let me tell you something. I'm like you. I'll go over there right now and step to it. Well, go, oh, over yeah. go right over there, bloated. Yeah. Right, somebody go, put, put, somebody you'll lose a lot of weight when your jaw's wide shut. <laughs> <laughs> your jaw's wide shut, folks. What's up? Ah, yeah. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> Any other observations before we get back out there? I'd like to know uh, why Bob have Kelly's to get so out? fat he can't even come back here. He can't leave his seat. <laughs> and what happened? He's just sitting out there. And where's, where's the great Bill Burr? <laughs> Bill didn't show, huh? Bob is, Bob is five pounds away from handicap plates. <laughs> <laughs> I can't wait to introduce him one day, and he rolls out on a little rascal oh. scooter. <laughs> it's only his upper torso that's gaining weight. Oh, I'm, I'm being concerned, man. His, his, legs. his legs are the exact same as I knew when I oh, first met him 15 years ago. Thank God all your vital organs yeah. are in your ankles. <laughs> <laughs> I screwed. But I'm saying he can't, he's not able to hold the oh, all that up? Yes. <laughs> he's going to need a block and tackle pulley oh. system just to walk around. <laughs> he's he's, he's a mess. like... He shaped like Peppermint Patty <laughs> from Charlie Brown. Bobby's built like a lesbian. <laughs> and that's a good time. Either. Back. Oh, hey, Bob, Bob. He came back. What? They're calling you fat. Like, I'm, now I come in. I can't hear you, Bob. Yeah, yeah easy, easy, Bob. people pleaser I am. Are they calling me fat? Where? Let me go. And let me go make it better for them. I'm getting, I'm getting called fat by a, a 40-year-old guy with a wizard outfit on. You know, that is true. What is wrong with Halloween. this picture? You I got a hobbit. Like a gay guy that played Magneto. I got, a, I, I got a hobbit. I got a golem. And I got a wizard. This is this is Lord of the Rings. And I got one of the big fat oak trees. Oh, oh, oh. No, he did. Oh, no, he did. Oh, no. Oh, no. I had nothing for Opie. You're a good-looking guy, Opie. Okay. I'm looking for this? somebody who has a Jack Tripper's outfit from one of the old episodes. Up to his con- oh, hey. Can I borrow this? Yeah, you sure can, Mr. Furley's outfit. Oh, look at him. Jesus Christ. 
Why do you, you look, got you look like Mrs. Rapture. Furley? How's your neck? Why'd you, why'd wow. you get greedy? What are you going to do? Rich Ross is in the room. <laughs> See the me or him. That is good when you take half the costume off, because now Colin's in an Adidas jogging suit with a grass skirt on. Actually, he, that's not a grass yeah. skirt. That's his contract from a Comedy Central for Tough Crowd. <laughs> 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 oh, that was a damn good one. Oh, How you doing? I've been fucking saving, oh, I've been saving that for a while, oh. fatso. <laughs> You're the only man that looks like he's wearing an ascot, but he's not. <laughs> damn it, Bobby! I wish the O and A fans I had. It's supposed to be funny right after that. Yeah, well, you know, what you know, you know, you said, Bobby said. You know, the O and A fans don't know what ascot is. <laughs> yeah. they, just think, yeah. they just think he called me a pastry. <laughs> oh, dude, he called him an ascot. Dude, ascot. <laughs> They're looking for. Scott, so they can ask him. <laughs> <laughs> God, make a spats joke. Oh, All right, we gotta get back out there. Uh, we don't. Jeez. Do we have to? I don't want to do it. I feel like I feel like some of the soldiers that got leave and then they have to go back. It's like I made it through one one round. Oh, they're so we wasted. Have to go back up. Out. They're so wasted. What, what, what's the note? What's the note there, Steve? Damn. Chuck D just showed up. Oh, Chuck D just showed up. Chuck oh, wow. D. Ah. Are they going to do something? Wow. Else? Are they going to do a little something? something? This could be the reunion of the year. No, Genghis DeLuise. <laughs> <laughs> wow. I don't like the. I don't. Like, I don't like that Quinn went to a room and wrote. <laughs> He's trying to make a comeback. He's trying to make a comeback on your damn Halloween show. Oh, God damn. Well, I was just going to say, we, we can get... That's shut it, Bobby. Stop. I know. Oh, just Bobby. Just let it go. We can get, oh, we can get that. You, he called you two, two fat people pee. from different times. He called you a 14th century fat man and a 20th century fat man oh. from completely different races. <laughs> oh. oh, my God. No, I, don't like, I don't like that. He called him. Yeah. I don't like that fat Keith uh, of Keith Sutherland who's getting me. Holy I don't like that. The, Why don't you two, shut up while we watch Cannonball Run outtakes? <laughs> and then we can watch uh, Fatso oh, on 224. God. Wow. Nice. How you doing? Nice talking uh, to you. Give me the mic back. Wow. Oh, God. Oh, Colin. <laughs> Really nice. <laughs> Colin Quinn is great. It's over. It's over. Colin, trained. you should give it up. This is great training. Yeah, Colin, you Genghis should go home, man. You're not going to much better than that tonight. Yeah, it's over. Genghis Delaware, shut it down, Bob. Two different I'm hemispheres sorry. on the globe. Uh, right. Wow. This right. is weird, man. Oh. It's like war to gourmet muffins. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, cause I, you know why? Cause I, I came in fat. You two got fat. You're a mess. We watched y'all disintegrate. I've been like this forever. I walk fine. Both of you come in waddling. My knees are used to it. Do you hear the opening? Do you hear the opening line? Chuck is going. How low can you go? Not under three hundred. <laughs> That's the steal of the hour of chaos. Uh, <laughs> all right. Oh. Yeah, we got to do it, huh? There was, it was therapeutic, I got to tell you. Because it, it was really frustrating on that stage for a while there. <laughs> yeah. All right. What, what are we doing next on the stage there? Candy eating. All right, we're going to do a candy, candy eating. Contest. Now, what type of candy? Is this going to be enough where someone's going to puke? Yeah. All right, let's get back. Five there. pounds. Opie is Pat from Monaki in this? <laughs> All right. Yeah. Oh, good. Opie, he's diabetic. Let's see his legs please. fall off. This is, uh, we got to go back in. Back in the field. That's it. Back out. Your hey, uh, R&R's over, ladies. Come on, boss. Let's walk by. Back Flavor, out in the Flav field. Dressing room. Once uh, more to the beach. <laughs> hey, Flav. Rich Boss has something to say to you, sir. Flavor, the door. Flav. Unless he think I'm Rich Boss. Flavor, Flav. Punch the first white person he sees. All right. It's the yeah. old virus. The open Kicked ass, show. my friend. What is it now? We are uh, heading back onto the stage. Might as well do this. Just continue. Yeah, continue right out hey, onto yeah. the stage. Joe Buck. We're on stage, and uh, there's the crowd. Some really hot chick is out there just uh, throwing what? Yep. Throwing lays out She's there. She's from Germany, Opie. Yeah? Yeah. Fraulein. She's, uh, she's beautiful. Yeah, right. the crowd seems to like her. They're getting ready Especially to. Especially the guy with the swastika on his arm. Nice costume. Flavor Flav is going to perform in a few minutes here. So that's going to be very, very cool. That was a lot of fun backstage. How you guys doing? You all right? You hanging in there? Yeah. All right. All right, all right, all right. Let's do, uh, let's do the candy eating contest. We're going to try that. Yep. 
All right, we're going to try the candy eating contest, uh, Anthony. That's better. How Thank many you. people are going to watch Jim Norton eat it on Letterman tonight? Oh. <laughs> that, that means... Oh, my God. I got, They're like, I got nothing. tonight? <laughs> what? But we're at a party tonight. They just got confused because it's a time travel thing that we're trying to do here. Yes, Jim Norton is going to be on Letterman tonight. Let's hear it. Yay! Yeah! Now we got to explain to someone in the front row that tonight means tomorrow because we're broadcasting yeah. a bit. Oh, my God. Ooh. Just go with it. Let's Ooh. make believe it's Wednesday. Yeah. It makes it so much easier for the listener. All right, we're going to do the candy eating contest. Yay. I want some. Now, I was a little concerned that there wouldn't be enough candy and it would just seem silly yeah. to have people popping a few pieces of candy corn in their mouth. But I'm uh, told it is pounds of candy. Yeah. Pounds of candy? So we c And I like that the barrels are here because that only means one thing. What? Vomit. Vomit, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah. Oh. And there is nothing funnier than seeing someone puke. It wouldn't be a party without vomit. Of course. All right, uh, we got the contestants or what, Steve? Where they at? Oh, my God, they had 15 minutes to get the contestants. But why do you think we were backstage? Bob Kelly? Pleasuring each other. All right, they couldn't get the word out. So. I, I couldn't get the word out. My leg was caught in a bear trap. All right, let's hear I had it for to Steve. chew my own appendage oh, wow. off. Steve has an announcement as they get the buckets of candy on the stage here. Steve! It looks like they went through Bob Kelly's uh, sofa cushions. <laughs> <laughs> if you signed up for the candy contest, please make your way to the right of the stage. Thank you very much. Wow, he's courteous. That means he hates you. That's yeah. right. You hear that? You hear that tone in his voice? That means that I despise everybody. Thank you very much. We still haven't gotten a song out of Anthony. We got the karaoke machine Oh, that's over there. true. Anytime you want. I'll uh, feel free to go up and uh, sing a little. While, while they're setting up, you want me to, uh, you want yeah. me to warble a little yeah. tune? Yeah, yeah. something. Yeah. Yeah. Neil Diamond, Anthony, Neil Diamond. Neil Diamond. Little something. All right, we're getting ready for the candy eating contest. Just Anthony Neil Diamond is stepping up to the karaoke machine. Anthony, a little Neil Diamond, what do you want is to do? Is this a uh, good mic for the, uh, you, for the stage? Anthony looks terrific in his this costume, a, by the way. This is a crowd pleaser. I think everybody knows this one. All right. This is an old more uh, more volume. Thank you. <laughs> Singing now, not just talking. For Christ's sake, I'm a professional. All right, here we go. I believe they never would. Whoa, 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 sweet Caroline. Good times never seem so good. Yeah, I've been inclined. Thank you. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Let's hear it for Anthony. <laughs> Never disappoint. Anthony, everyone. Oh, it's such a crowd favorite. All right, we're just about ready for Party Flavor gifts. Flav. He said he's going to go on stage at 1030, right? America, just a few minutes away from Flavor Flav playing live here at the Hard Rock Cafe for our Halloween party. Now, boss, you were just talking to the people in the front row. What's going on? Well, they're, they're going wild. I'm giving them candy. And the little guy up front there, uh, what's his name? Neo? Neo. Neo wants to get on stage and take his clothes off. Oh, oh boy. Well, it's a good photo op for everybody. Wow. We love photo ops for the fans. So why don't we get Neo on stage? Neo, you want to uh, describe Neo to everybody, Anthony? Uh, I, you He's, know something? Uh, I you pride myself on being able to describe Whoa. things. I can't. <laughs> He, uh, well, he's, he's, uh, he's, he's about like, five foot tall, tops. Well, almost like a midget. He's got tumors uh, sticking out of his body all over the place, or it looks like tumors. There he is. He's taking wow. his shirt off for the crowd. This is uh, kind of filler as we wait for Flavor Flavor. It's some stage. kind of, uh, have we determined what he has? I don't know. Why don't we talk to him? Dan, why don't we get a mic on Neo? I see a couple of scars in the back where there might have been some surgeries. Yeah, he's dressed, successful. He's, he's dressed as aliens. Huh? Does, does insurance uh, cover Neo. Dr. Frankenstein? Neo is hammered. Neo! Neo, how you doing, bro? I'm fucking hammered, dude. Are you fucking hammered? I love Opie Anthony. Fuck everyone else. <laughs> Fuck Howard Stern. Fuck everyone else! 
Yeah, I, I feel like that too. This is awkward for everybody. Try to not curse as much. Ne- there, Neo, Neo, what what is the actual term for what you have? Morphios. M O R Q U I O U S. And what does that mean? What does that do? Uh, it affects the scale through fucking skin drum. Uh huh. Listen to it. I don't. I know you fucking niggas don't listen to the shit. Listen to it. Fucking. Who cares? Dude. Oh, who cares? It's skeletal. It's skeletal. Skeletal. Fuck the skeletal syndrome. Stupid skeletons. Who cares, dude? Come on. I hear you. Uh, All right, why don't you address the crowd, Neo? Neo, do they have that? This is a fucking Opie Anthony. This is a fucking Paris XO XO underscore O five. Listen, XO. Yo, listen, everyone. Fuck this. Brings his own custom. Opie Anthony. He is so hammered. He is and you know what? He the has the best party out of most of your audience. <laughs> Isn't that odd? The girls are loving The him. girls love him. Yeah, they're, he's they're calling for him. Debra. He's just screaming out girls' names. Hey, Neo. Oh, no. All right. Oh, no. Neo's, Neo's getting naked. All right. I think we're just about ready for Flavor Flav. I hope so. I see a lot of people... Uh, on the side of the stage that... Oh, jeez. Oh, my right. God. Well, Neo is completely naked. Has he tucked? The Flavor Flav Posse <laughs> is uh, horrified. Holy shit. Wait, I, you He's know what? a nice little ass. Neo, spin around. Spin around, around Neo. <laughs> Neo is tucked. He's pulling a uh, Silence of the Lambs. Yeah, he, uh, he uh, oh. got completely naked for the, for the crowd. Hey, Neo, will you come to... Uh, Crackers in Indianapolis this week and do that for me when I'm there. Okay, Neo, uh, you you know you know what the constellation is that when you just did that and saw all those flashes, it won't end up on any websites. Yeah, don't worry about that. Shit. Who gives us shit? It's fucking O'Fans and you motherfuckers. Uh, he go. doesn't care. He doesn't care. All right, let's hear it for Neo. Hi, uh, Neo. Oh. Thanks, bro. <laughs> Someone, right. someone put him back into the little stuffed animal machine that you pull out with a claw. Oh, he fell down. He's uh, Neo. <laughs> Neo, are you that hammered where you fell down? He's just crawling across <laughs> the stage right now. God damn, Neo. He can't be more than 4'10", I'm thinking, uh, right? Tops. With a, like a, There's nothing more entertaining than a drunk uh, midget. I'm, All right. Yes, boss. I think we're just about ready for Flavor Flav to I save this party. So. Keith, Keith is uh, horrified. Yeah. Hi, girls. How you doing up front there, ladies? You guys hanging check, in there? Check, check. Check, check. All right, we got some check, checks going, so. Yeah. Check, check, check. One, two. All right, we'll... Ah, uh, oh, this is going to be cool. Yeah, let's see how this develops here, right? Club Soda Kenny, we ready for Flavor Flav? When was the last time Flav uh, performed live? Why is Kenny laughing? Oh. Whose idea was it to book him? Why? What's what's the problem? Nah, uh, they're you know they're getting ready. It takes a while. Yeah. It just takes a while to get everything all ready to go. Yeah, the choirs all lined up. Yeah. All right. Well, this well, should be time, interesting. It's because they want it to sound good. You got a problem? What are you yeah. thinking? What are you thinking? Back in Jersey? No, I I, I love them. All right. They're just check checking. All right, there. Ah, uh, uh, Jimmy Norton rejoining us. Thank goodness. Check, check, check. Hey. All right, we're just about ready for Flavor Flav. Check. What the fuck is up, New York? <laughs> New York, what's up? Hit me, hit me, hit me, hit me. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yo, Lord. Let's hear it for Flavor Flav! Everybody, Flav! Flavor Flav! And we'll be back. Thanks, Flav. With the Opie and Anthony Show, the ONA virus spreading across America. It's our Halloween party at the Hard Rock Cafe. Oh, Flavor yeah. Flav was amazing. Wow. Absolutely amazing. What was more amazing was the entourage. Uh, yeah. <laughs> there was uh, quite an entourage with Flavor Flav people. tonight. More than we take with us. We have like Club Soda Kenny, Keith. That's about it. <laughs> All right. I guess it's time for the costume contest. Yes, let's so, do this. So let's get back on stage here. And uh, let's get on the stage and get this. Uh, 
Let's get this costume contest done. You guys ready for the costume contest or what, huh? All right, we got the finalists on the stage for the Opie and Anthony costume contest. What? 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 They want to go up there. Uh, and, and look, they're they're batting their eyes. I say you let them. It's only <laughs> fair. At the end, at the end, we'll do a whole thing with the girls on the stage and the wow and do what they want with the marital aids and that'll end this uh, this mess. All right, these are the finalists in the costume contest, Anthony. Yes. Oh. All right, we're ready. Here we go. Our first contestant, our first finalist. State your name and tell us what you are. Because it's radio. I mean, the people at home got to understand yeah. this. What the hell are you? What are you? Steve the Bear. Oh, you're Steve the Bear. He's right. got like a Harley thing on, a flaming shirt, and he's dressed like a bear, and he's drinking. All right, why don't All you right. go to the front of the stage? What do you guys think of Steve the Bear? Not too happy with Steve the Bear. They don't like mixed. Steve the Bear at all. They don't care for him. All right, let's uh, move on. It's mixed. We got Robert Reed, a fat version of Robert Reed. Shouldn't you be? <laughs> Robert Reed, he's got his, uh, his bowl of broth and his skeleton. And uh, he's looking very, all oh, robe with tissues. <laughs> See, that would have been a great contest if he weighed like 120 pounds, but he well, weighs about 320 he, pounds. He's, he's making a point. It is Robert Reed. All right, let's uh, see what the crowd thinks. We do what do you use guys him on the show a lot. Robert Reed. All right, I think if you liked Robert Reed. All right, they're a little, uh, they're not too happy with the costume. And so now far. we have uh, the box of Jimmy's tender sentiments. They destroyed my black box. Huh? They ravaged my black box. They took all my signs. Oh, uh, they took all your tender sentiments. Oh. All right. Well, so what is? Does, does it say anything anymore? It's just, you're now just a paper towel dispenser. I am something pretty much what you are. Not so tender sentiments stinks. Uh, they're holding up the tender sentiments, yeah. the not so tender sentiments in the crowd. Go lick magic paper cut. All right, what do you guys think of him? Come on. All right, not good, not good. All right, moving on with the. So far, okay, next. The costume contest. All right, next we have, wow. I got to tell you, next, is, it's yeah, no filter, boy. Paul, the bravest man in the house, because yeah. he was in blackface yeah, the whole boy. time Flavor Flav was performing. He was in uh, Flav's entourage, <laughs> yeah. dressed like that. And he's dressed, of course, like well, Flavor Flav. What do you guys think of no filter, Paul, as Flavor Flav? Wow, I don't think they're judging the costume. I think they're judging the person. What is my right. ass, dickhead. What do you think? You guys should suck it. Yeah, yeah he's not happy. All right. I think nice. it looks good, but they just don't like him. No. It's, uh, wow. The Destroyer. A lot of people call me Tax. I believe he's, uh, <laughs> he's dressed as me. He's got a brown shirt on. The back says board off. The front says The Destroyer. He's holding some blueberries. 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 He's got his good luck bro bracelet on. That's right. That he tells people uh, before they die. He's got mouse, uh, mouse, mouse trap, trap for around the house. You never know. He's got the awful hair that I have every morning. He's got the <laughs> sunglasses. morning hair. Not bad, not bad. Wait a minute. He's got the same shoes on that I used to stop the homeless guy's cake. Wow. This guy went all out. All right. Yeah, you, uh, you got to give him a little bit of that. That's right. What do you guys think of uh, Opie? They oh, like my me. God. They really like me. He did a pretty good job. Not bad. God, the same shoes that I used to stomp the cake. That's Now, this impressive. is very original. This is very original. This... The next this costume, costume, you want to explain it, Anthony? This costume is... It's me circa 19... Uh, wait, Ed, you oh. better hold on because yeah. no one's paying attention to you. Because, Danny, come on out here. Our own Danny decided to <laughs> hey, get to the front of the stage. Get to the front, front of the front of the stage. stage. Danny as <laughs> as Borat, as Borat, and that awful. My mustache it will not stay on. I need some tape. <laughs> oh my God, Danny's got the biggest wow. fall. Uh, Danny's look, clipped. You <laughs> look like an idiot. Danny's now arguing with mustache. another so Borat. What are you talking about? Yaksha <laughs> Yes, I like very much. 
Hey, Danny, have a razor. I would like to make very much sex crime with you. Yes, <laughs> Oh, my God. Danny is pretty much naked. It's a sock. And his mustache don't stay on. His fucking mustache won't stay on. That's it's right. You got enough hair all everywhere else. This makes this makes the, the costume, and I can't get it to work. All right, Danny. Very nice, Danny. Wow. Good in job. the Borat swimsuit that we've all seen in the commercial, it's just a horrific yeah. sight. You're going to have to check that one out on opianthony.com later today. All right. Yeah, here's uh, a girl. She hey. dressed like me from 1992 in one of my Rock Gut videos. I thought you were Tony Orlando. Yeah, that's... Uh, you lost the goatee part in the crowd. That'll happen. But dressed like me in one of my videos from 1992. Wow. That is a very obscure but very well... You see? Yeah. Very nice. With the Budweiser yeah. case. Very good job. Just as the lead singer, of course, Anthony of Rod yes, Gun. Yes, of Rod From Gun. 1992 Wonderful. with the Budweiser and everything. You got it good down. Good job. Very nice. What do you guys think of Anthony from 1992? I... Uh, you 1992. Know, Very nice. Hang around. So far, it's Opie and uh, Anthony from 1992. All right. All right. Here's Borat. What do you guys think of Borat? <laughs> the other version of Borat. What do you think of Danny's Borat? Look at Danny's brother taking pictures of his cock. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> And Danny's mom you know, in the front row. You know what it is? They've never seen it soft. <laughs> hey, Danny's mom, what do you think of Danny's cock? Love it. It's big. <laughs> oh, wow. Like his dad. <laughs> yeah, my mom just said she loves oh Danny's my God. dick. All right, very good. What a freaking cluster F this has turned out to be. All right. Uh, all right. Thank so, you, Borat. So Borat in the, uh, in the suit, yes or no? No, I think you're out, bro. I think Danny Trump you. I'm, I'm sorry. So far, it's down to No Filter Paul, right. Obi, and Anthony from 1992. Yeah, 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 yeah. George Harrison, old pudding head. Huh? <laughs> George Harrison, and he has pudding on his head. He's old oh, pudding okay. head. He just he's George, George Harrison, Harrison, old pudding head. <laughs> and he's, he's got, got pudding in his head. That is pretty fucking funny. I agree. Right, stick around. You're good. You're good. Stick that around. Stick funny. around. All right, back up. You're, you're in the finals. There. Old pudding head. Who's next in the costume contest? What's your name? And for the audience at home, who are you dressed as? I've been brutally raped and murdered, so apparently I'm Steve's idea of high teen news. Wow. Do you have a thong on? That will help in the voting. This is uh, deeply disturbing. Uh, she's yeah, got... It's pretty cool. She's got uh, blood... Yes. Blood coming out. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> how do you describe this? I don't know. I like it. I like it. She has blood down her thigh. Well, that's going to help the judges right there. Oh, wow. yeah. A little flash you never heard. Do you want to make some hurts. money? Huh? Angel fought for wag bag. Very good. Very good. What do you think, uh, What do you guys think? What do you think? All right, they like it, Anthony. They like it. Who's next? Nicole. Hi. Hi, Nicole. Nicole dressed as a wow sticker today. A wow sticker. Yuck. All right. What do you guys think uh, of Nicole as a wow sticker? Yes, no? That costume stunk. All right, no. Sorry, Nicole. All right, moving on. <laughs> oh, it's... <laughs> it is, uh, wow, one of the girls that I went horseback riding with in California, Dreamweaver. Dreamweaver. And you look better than she did. Yeah, he's... Is, is that you, Wrangler? Uh, yeah. Tell me I look like Tatum O'Neill, Daddy. <laughs> Another disturbing. And I'll tell you concept. something. The girl to horse proportion was about right. Yeah. All right, he's on a fake horse. See, she was fat. You know, nah, one, of the, one of the famous uh, stories. Oh, of course. Very Dreamweaver. good. Okay, I like very the nice. Dreamweaver. All right, who's next? Good go? job. All right, here's the next contestant, the next finalist in the costume contest. Hi, I'm Sam. Oh, he's Sam. He's, he's half black and half white. He's got an afro. 
and very small and he's thumbs. Try, no, his thumbs aren't quite big enough, but all right, and you weigh about 20 Sam's, but uh, that's not saying much. Uh, uh, all right, they're not digging the sand, but thanks for coming on stage and being in the no, finals. I don't think they're digging them. Who's next? We're just about done here. Then we got to pick a winner. Oh, this is a team effort. That's my little movie called Death Wish. It's a team effort. They are uh, the oh. club. Ah, uh, well, they're play acting on the stage. Yes. It's the goddamn rich cunt, I hate rich cunts clip yeah. from Death Wish. They're reenacting that on the stage. What do you guys think? Yes? No? I no. like it. No. They're not thinking uh, it. I kind of like the spirit of it all. It yes. involves beating her. All right. And is this the last finalist right here? Yeah. yeah. And you are? This is for Jimmy. It's uh, Monster Rain. Monster and Rain. All right, he's a monster and it's raining. It stinks. Well, it looks pretty evil. He's got a cloud over his head. It does look scary. Monster, yeah. Yeah. You took all the hotness out of the story. All right, uh, who are the finalists then? I'd say our finalists would have to be Old Puddinghead. Old Puddinghead. Old Puddinghead got a, a pretty big laugh. All right, Puddinghead. Who else um, is the finalist? Uh, Dream Don't Weaver. Dr. Paul is Flavor yeah. Flav. Yes. Old Anthony. Old Anthony from yeah, 1992 sure. as the lead singer of Rot Gut. The, uh, the, the dead victim. murdered girl. I think they got a nice response. Huh? Yeah. The girl who got murdered. The, the girl nice that got response. murdered and raped and murdered, we should say. Yes. Yeah, raped and murdered. A, she was my date. That's a and, uh, twisted side. And, yeah, I guess and Dreamweaver. And Dreamweaver? Yeah. What about the, uh, the fake Opie? Uh, didn't make the cut? All right. throw him a bone. It's up to you. Well, we're we got to get Danny in here. Well, Danny can't. Wait. I think he's already changing. Oh. Yeah. Oh, no filter. Paul, get in line and shut up. All right, it's down to these five. So everyone else off the stage, thanks for uh, thank you participating there they go. in the costume contest. Thanks for trying. Now go and die. Oh, some disappointed die. people in the crowd, but that always happens. Opie, a lot of people have their favorites, uh, but that doesn't pan out sometimes. And now we have our finalists. All right, vote now, for your favorite. Yes. Now remember. Booze will count as yays. That's right. The loudest the one, loudest one the loudest is going to win. All right. You are go. about a miserable fuck. You have done nothing all night. You fat fucking cocksucker have done nothing all night but flip everyone off. Everything. Why don't you just get the fuck out if you're not having a good time? I have not seen this guy nope. with everything that has happened. You flip the bird, you start chants, you're moping about. Get the fuck out, you don't want to stay in here. I've had it. What's your message board name? What? What's your message board name? My board name? Warrior. Warrior. Oh, it should be miserable cunt. He's hated everything in. All right. Back to the... Well, that'll be the director's a, cut. A warrior in what war? The war against dieting? <laughs> Here That's we go. Defeated. All right, our finalists. Our finalists, vote for your favorite, guys, all right? Is it going to be Anthony from 1992 as the lead singer of Rod Cut? All right. All right. Old Puddinghead. Oh. George Harrison, old Puddinghead. Uh-oh, it might be George Harrison. All right. How about No Filter Paul is Flavor Flav? Flavor. No, no. I'm sorry, Paul. You're just too hated. What the, about uh, the girl that was raped and murdered? Uh, Not, uh, wow, look at them. She cheated by flashing, but what are you going to do? No, it's all right. That's what happened during a rape. And my old love from San Juan Capistrano, Dreamweaver. All right, Paul, get the fuck out of here. Yeah, Paul, you're uh, out. Paul, you can leave. You're out, Tom. Who uh, else can yeah, leave? I think you're uh, out. I appreciate yeah. the gesture. 1992, Anthony. Butler, 1992, you gotta go. Anthony. All right, down to these three. Once again, vote for your favorite. Yell for your favorite. Is it going to be George Harrison? George Harrison, old Harrison Pudding Pudding Head. Head. How about the girl that was raped, raped and murdered? Murdered girl. 
Dreamweaver. Uh, Dreamweaver. Dreamweaver's out. You gotta go, Dreamweaver. It, it sure is be close between these two. These Boy, two. yes. If you had a set of cans, it would be in the bag for you. All right, vote for your favorite. I uh, get nice and loud here. Once again, it's down to these two. Is it going to be old pudding head George Harrison? How about the girl dressed as a uh, rape victim and rape a murder, murder victim? victim. Harrison. And I'm saying, George, George Harrison. Harrison, old pudding head, has won the Halloween costume contest. I beat the tits. Wonderful. Yes, you did, sir. You beat him. Uh -huh. yeah, beat him. He went in for the kiss and she backed off. That's what she gets, cancer brain. <laughs> Let's hear it for old Congratulations. Pudding Head George Harris. It's five hundred dollars courtesy, actually a thousand dollars courtesy wow. of MajorWorld.com. You won a cool grand, and there's uh, prizes for second and third. Is that what it is? Second place. Hey, you get five hundred bucks there, dead uh, raped girl. Five hundred dollars. Uh, by and the way, then, first place also got a Rob Zombie autographed piece of artwork, courtesy of Rob Zombie's new CD, and a Pioneer. You I've know, been from very XM. badly raped, you see. Ooh. Ooh, there you go. Pass out nice. the gifts. And you're about to again. And who was in third place? They won some money as well. They won about two hundred and fifty dollars for it third was, place. It uh, was Dreamweaver, wasn't it? Dreamweaver. Yeah, third Dreamweaver place? gets uh, third place. All right. Wonderful. Well, wow, we got some thank yous thank before yous. we get out of here. Holy We're Jesus. here for Robin from MySexyStore.com for the marital aids. Also, Classic Car Club for the fancy cars that took us to the Hard Rock Cafe tonight. Classic Car, ClassicCarClub.com. Major World for the prize money. A Mr. Pest Jr. for the glue traps. Yeah, whatever. All right, Flavor Flav. Let's hear it for Flavor Flav and his entourage. Also, the ONA show crew for busting their asses, setting up the contest and bits for the show. And for the all-nighter, they're about to pull editing, the, editing this thing. Yeah, have fun, guys. Good luck on that. Don Wicklin for all his work behind the scenes at XM. Ron and Fez. Hey, Ron and Fez. Big hand for Ron and Fez. All of our comedian friends, Patrice O'Neill, Otto and George, Bob Kelly, Colin Quinn, Rich Boss, and whoever else showed up that I forgot. And uh, let's not forget Ryan Starr. He uh, did a great job. He rocked earlier. Did you guys have fun or what? Thank you. Thank you guys for coming to our Halloween party here at the Hard Rock Cafe. Bye. And we'll see you on the radio tomorrow. Thank you so much, Thank guys. You.